bet you watch the 51, 50 show, nigga. Ain't no stop the 51, 50 show, nigga. Tempers be cocked at the 51, 50 show, nigga. Villains be dropped at the 51, 50 show, nigga. Bitch, watching the 51, 50 show, nigga. Ain't no stopping the 51, 50 show, nigga. Tempers be cocked at the 51, 50 show, nigga. Villains be dropped at the 51, 50 show, nigga. Peace returns. The brothers had to work it out. Love won the battle of betrayal and doubt The forces of good are back on the same page Don't give a fuck what a bitch hater got to say 5150 is back in full effect The crew is solid, begin the dialect The best show on the internet, banging hard Hey hater niggas, tell the world we are about to start Get your popcorn ready as I crack the jokes But real shit out my lips every time I spoke Know what I'm doing, it never ever goes bad I turn chaos on the show in the cold cash Cause drama and pain is always gonna sell Broke niggas got me can go the fuck to hell Now sit back and watch the shine, talking shit about mine I'm in a studio, you at the crib crying Hey nigga, and I fuck your daughter all the time And the bitch ain't nowhere near fine The hoe built like a swine Start the show, we ain't never on why he be saying stuff like that? He not favored by the Lord. Amen. 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 Me and Zoe together. Amen. Amen. We back friends. Amen. We go win. Amen. 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 Mark is hiding his head. Amen. Take it off your skin. Amen. Amen. <laughs> hey, G Thang and Jeff Brown got a, a mixtape coming out. So fuck Corey Uncle. <laughs> I never. I love Jeff Brown, man. Yeah, he good. I want to say that starting the show. I love Jeff Brown. I just. It's something about me. Like if you say something, like where I'm from, we used to signify all day. Yeah. Me and Marcus was talking about this shit earlier. You think folks know what you're talking about? No, they know oh, what I'm talking okay. about. Okay. We sig signification, if that's the real word. Oh, not that. I was talking about Jeff Brown. It happens. Mm. People say shit to people where they stab at a motherfucker, especially if you stab it at me. Prepare for the comeback. Nigga, I'm ready at all. I don't, I don't have to practice. I'm a bear. I'm that nigga. So, yeah. no, I went on Zoe's show and I, and I was, you know, we was talking. Me and Zoe talked on the phone and we got straight. And we both apologized to each other. Bitch niggas talking about, why you want to apologize to Zoe? Nigga, we men, mm -hmm. we apologized to each other and got straight. But there are people in the world who think that people owe them an explanation. <laughs> and unfortunately, my brother Jeff Brown wanted me to explain something to him, and I felt like I needed to tell him other things that needed to be explained. So I said something slick about him. In and, his uh, face? Yeah, he was sitting right there. Yeah. A lot of stuff I say, man, it don't necessarily be a lie. It be true to it. Like, he brought up the fact that I said something about Brother Zoe is like, what did I say? I said some bullshit about, I use you for your smarts on the show or something like that. Yeah. The way I said it, it was in a, it was in a way where I was talking shit. Mm -hmm. But it actually is the truth. Zoe is above average, way above average when it comes to retaining information and being able to put it back out there. Mm -hmm. Certainly. But what I said is I only use it for that. And that's not true. I use Zoe, man, I call Zoe. I'm talking about before we fell out. It ain't just like that. But... My brother Jeff Brown wanted to emphasize that point, so I said something back to him. I said something back to him, and I could tell he was hurt. What'd you say, Cole? I, I, I could tell he was hurt, <laughs> and uh, what happened was I, was, I went home, I almost had an accident laughing, because he said, 
that's okay. I got my TV show, and you're not going to be on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he said he wrote a part for you. <laughs> I was over there dying, Jeff. You crazy, boy. That was funny. I'm going to bring Jeff on the show one day if he wants to come on the show still. And I'm going to let him talk it out because I ain't got nothing against Jeff. It's just Jeff. Jeff, Jeff got loyalty for... Um, my brother Zoe, as he should. Zoe yeah. let him be on his show all the time. So he should have loyalty for Zoe. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't gonna go in too long about that shit. It was just funny. Now we straight. So Good. I'm glad to see that, man. I was out of town, man, going through what I was going through, man. And I went, went Rest back. Rest in peace to your boy, man. Yeah, oh. man. Rest in peace to my dog, Lloyd Smoy, Lloyd Smith. We man. lost a comedian, too, man. Rest in peace to Big Mike. Did you know Big Mike? Yeah. He was the king of the Bringer show, man. Oh, the what show? The Bringer show. You know when motherfuckers first started comedy, that was, you want to be on my show? <laughs> Can you bring 10 people? Was he out here? Uh, yeah, he was from out here. He was getting his money on. Big Mike. Yeah. Did, when did he pass? What did he pass? He died like last week. I, I think he had a heart attack or complications or something, but he was a cool person, man. He was you good people. You seen him before. You just got to see him, Marcus. Yeah, like you when we all used to be, be at the improv. The improv. Yeah. He was funny, hey. man, because he was one of them comics. He didn't believe in writing jokes. Yeah, you know, you know what I'm saying. Well, so what do he do? He just every time he got he's on just stage, he's just freestyle <laughs> for 20 years, though. Oh shit! <laughs> was he good? <laughs> was he, a was he any good? That mean he couldn't write jokes. Yeah, I mean, uh, was, he, was he a host? Because you know, there's comedians and yeah. there's hosts. There's he, an he, MC. I mean, I've seen him do both, but he, to me, what I got from him, he just was enjoying just doing comedy. I don't think he was really serious serious about you know going to that next next level he yeah. just was i feel like he was just medicating with it because he's been sick for a while you know what i mean mm, he had the cancer yeah right. rest in peace big yeah, mike he yeah, was cool he gave me some laughs yeah. yeah. oh he gave some laughs yeah he gave me some laughs he wanted motherfuckers that it was always something where you just wouldn't expect like what what was about to happen you know what i mean yeah he was good folks man rest in peace big mike man mm -hmm. r.i.p big mike that's right what was your god name lloyd smith say are you saying lawrence lloyd Lord? Lloyd, Lloyd, or Floyd? L L O Y D, Lloyd. Yeah, oh, Lloyd. Lloyd. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hey man, this shit going fast. Out that was here, my man. signifying partner, man. Back in the day, y'all yeah, used to go at it. Oh man, oh fat nigga. But yeah. that nigga can, man, something about fat niggas can go, boy. <laughs> yeah. Fat niggas and ugly man, motherfuckers. Man, fat niggas can roast, boy. <laughs> <laughs> David, fat ass, that nigga yeah. roast. But yeah, we, he was the only, when I was coming up through school, man, that was the only motherfucker that can get with me. He'll win some, I, I'll win some, man. But that was my dog, man. Rest I got man. him on the way out, though, man. I, I had yeah. to speak at the funeral and shit. Yeah. You just be, riding his ass? I just got him one time, man. You gotta, I just, gotta I gotta get it. He wouldn't yeah. have it no other way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't even have a funeral. Motherfuckers be up there talking <laughs> shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, he shouldn't have said that when he was mad. <laughs> <laughs> Goof ass out of here, nigga. Don't you know I'm not gonna do what y'all want me to do? That's why you watch me. <laughs> if I did like you, I'd be like you asking my girl, can I go empty garbage? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sitting up here telling me what I need to do in my motherfucking game, nigga. I'm out of here, nigga. I get, I, I, but I tell you what, when, when righteousness presents itself, I hop on it. Right. Yeah. I hop on it. I can't stand Darlene, but she still is. <laughs> <laughs> Why you? Why I oughta? <laughs> Hell yeah, she's gonna punch you in the back Slowly of the head one day. Slowly I man. turn. Step by step. step. They don't know nothing about that. We older That's than old them. That's old school, dude. I know. What That's so that? great. Some break elderly up. shit. Oh, show you gotta watch age. it. You love that cartoon. Yeah. What's the name of the cartoon? You love it. She don't know. Oh. She just repeated it. No, no, no. Did y'all quote no, the time and Jerry? But I can say it. I'm and looking in the camera later. like we got camera shots and I'm. I must say, I am a very handsome oh, man. Oh, my God. Well, at least you up I thank higher. God for my look sometimes. That's oh. what get me through this game. The Levert on the Levert side of the game? Oh, nigga done lost. Nigga done lost six pounds. You catch the nose. Your life is over. <laughs> 
Craig, you look cab driverish today. Why not, man? You know, I knew I was gonna be on the show with the vampire in Brooklyn tonight. So I was like, Fuck it. Good one. Good one. This is velvet. The cab velvet. drivers be hating on the Uber driver. They be like, you get the Uber driver. Why can't them motherfuckers? They're stealing from our families. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck cab drivers, nigga. Can't stand the motherfuckers. Uh, we got the talk. Uh, was getting into it. Uh, they who? They was getting into it at one point in time. Who? I think they was fighting oh, each other. Oh, in the very beginning. Yeah. Cab, yeah. Yeah. cab, cab driver, who driver? They was fighting each other in one city. It was, it was getting down. Nigga, I thought they were finished because I used to be driving an Uber. I thought they was going to have to strike, try to strike it up with me, man. Look, man. Uh, be one of these cab drivers ass out here. Them cab drivers ran the Uber out of the airport in L.A. Yeah. Yeah. They ain't run me out that motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> Still picking motherfuckers up. Hell yeah, I'll pick motherfuckers up. My nigga Marcus, man, that nigga was driving so many hours. This nigga flipped the car. He fell asleep. <laughs> I thought that's what you said, yeah. Some people Uber for some hours. Mar Marcus just, I'm Ubering everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> so you think you're getting in the same <laughs> I used to run 12 hour shifts on that Uber. A nigga, when you told me you flipped that car, I was like, you ain't getting no sleep. See, Marcus actually think he's Superman. Thank God there was no customer. He be everywhere in the world. He ain't never worried about oh, COVID. Oh, God. Marcus act like he invincible. I know that feeling, though, but I'm just saying. Damn. Y'all heard that shit? Yep. Yeah. Hey, man, I was taught to live, man. Just live. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? Like if it the... don't happen, it don't happen. Oh, yeah, roll yeah. with the punches. Mm -hmm. You ain't kicked nobody else your Uber? I did that one time. Hell yeah. Picked this gay nigga up, man. He sat behind me. Wasn't nobody in the car but me and him. He sat behind me. He sat behind me. And as I started driving. He was smelling you, dog. The nigga rubbed the back of my head. Oh, shush. Nigga, I pulled that car over and so motherfucking. Oh, And what you do? Nigga, I said, man, get the, I'm about to whoop you. Get the fuck out of my car. Nigga. You didn't touch him, did you? No, I didn't You're touch serious. him. You're serious. Word is out. I don't want to catch that shit. Them niggas got... heard that you I can run. Like <laughs> 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 the nigga did say some weird shit to me before. What? The nigga did say some weird shit to me before. Yeah, <laughs> niggas flirt with you because you little. No. They can't tell you. <laughs> you a little nigga. Nigga ain't scared to say shit to you, hey, nigga. nigga. Yeah. Bring that ass right. over here, little Arkansas nah, nigga. That's all right. Got that nigga got a body. Got that nigga a body there, though, boy. That's <laughs> that motherfucker. I was mad at the motherfucker, too, boy. Why? Because nigga said something. What'd he you, say? Oh, you so handsome. Or nah, some nah. shit like that. But he had to look, he had to look gay lisp. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. What he said. Right. You know what I'm saying? Was he real tall? But, but if he didn't have <laughs> 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 You said what? He was bigger than you? No, no. Well, he was bigger than, probably bigger than me, but. Man, that's gay shit. Nigga, what you talking about? Nigga, how you know he was bigger than you? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I ain't looking at the nigga. Fuck you, man. Don't let him amp you up. We're talking about some other shit. Uh, exactly. <laughs> Silly. He's about the same size. But I had to pick motherfucker out, man. Uh, motherfuckers. It was some, some gay. You know how you pick motherfuckers up at 3 o'clock in the morning and shit? Yeah. Motherfuckers back there. And what you say, 3 o'clock in the morning? Yeah, 3 o'clock in the morning. Okay. Motherfuckers back there kissing the shit, niggas. Oh, yeah. Hey, man, what I'm the not fuck a... y'all doing, man? That yeah, nigga's yeah, like, drive, yeah. bitch, nigga. Hey, y'all see a survival on the no... dashboard? What the <laughs> fuck y'all doing kissing in my car? <laughs> niggas kissing niggas in my car, motherfucker. I don't <laughs> understand yeah. gay Christians, man. Talk about it. In the Bible, it say you're going to hell. I, I'm not saying you're going to hell, but in the Bible, it say... I'm saying you're going to hell. But in the... So why would you... <laughs> Don't it say that in the Bible, Marcus? Or am I, I tripping? I mean, I, 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 I it, it say it, but it don't say it like I forgot what the verse is. Uh, honestly, but I don't read that. <laughs> I don't read that shit like you that. You just say you don't know what he's talking about. I, don't, I, I mean, I've heard it before, but I right, mean, you don't know what he's talking about, though. I know what you're talking about. I think I used raised he in the church, man, but can't, can't I don't remember the verse verbatim, though. Right. I'm going to look it up right now. Spit it on the air. What does it say about dick on dick and bite? Oh. <laughs> the book of Diculus. <laughs> the book of Somebody, dicking us. Somebody uh, in damnation or some shit. I, I can't remember. The, the net running so slow, it's going to, okay, let me see. Jesus used to be walking around with that motherfucking robe on. They ain't had draws out back then. That nigga was free balling, talking about he's trying to save you. <laughs> Jesus no, straight think... telling you what you need to do with no drawers on and a silk robe. Gee, That's think... why a lot of people ain't follow him and they walk around, them. Walking around with his dick disciples. His dick disciples? <laughs> <laughs> dick sucklers? <laughs> yeah, Jesus was trying to talk to straight up real motherfuckers out there in a the robe. They hung him for that shit. Mm. 
I was like, man, this nigga gonna tell me I need to give away all my shit and trust him. <laughs> and this that, nigga ain't got no drawers on. Is that how he said Fuck it? Fuck him up! <laughs> That's how he said it. <laughs> <laughs> We laughing, but that's really what happened, dog. Mm. Straight up. It was some ruthless motherfuckers. They hung a nigga on the cross and was looking at him. Yeah, that's some oh, demented yeah. psychopath. Do you really, shit. right, do you think about that shit? Yeah. They did. That nigga was up there like this. They, was like, they hung niggas like that. For three right. days. Right, who did? Nine. White folk. They said, damn, watch niggas hanging from a goddamn noose. You gotta be a cold motherfucker, man. I can black hard as shit. Nigga, you know, white uh, folks uh, impregnated a monkey with a human baby and the baby lived. Pregnant. I mean, and, and, the, and, the, and the monkey was pregnant for three months and then had a miscarriage. A what? Fact. White folks did that. They, they impregnated with, a, with, with, a, with somebody black? They impregnated a female monkey with human sperm. Look it up. What sperm they used, though? Did they I, use I, I don't know. I don't know. Are these scandalous white people facts? Because I got one. Go ahead. White people give niggas shots that they don't even tell you what it is and tell you you can't sue us if you die from it. Man. Somebody topping that? <laughs> white folks no. used to feed look, uh, newborns, black newborns, and gators. Yeah. Yeah. Cheering. Mm -hmm. Gators. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cold, but White hurt, folks hurt. stole everything that they claim is there. <laughs> Am I topping that? You said claim everything. That about what? sums it up. Everything that white people claim is theirs was stolen. Everything except this dance. <laughs> 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 yeah, I would say that that's definitely uh, accurate. On yeah. top of that, y'all ready for this? Go for it. I'd love for y'all to comment on this. White folks egged black folks that work for them to go on national TV and say, Tom Brady is the best <laughs> NFL player ever. <laughs> and, there's and niggas did it. Niggas is on TV set. Do you know how many raw motherfuckers played in the National oh, Football man. League? Man. If you're getting ready to start a franchise and you could pick anybody who played in the NFL, are you going to pick Tom Brady? Mm. No, hell no. <laughs> and it made him 70 to 75% no. black? Mm hmm. Or is it more? Probably Might be bigger now. to say 70%. Yeah. yeah. It's called a humanzy. A hundred years ago, a doctor in Florida. Well, do they have pictures of it? Oh, you're talking about the ape. A humanity. Yeah. They don't have pictures. Somebody said Barry Sanders. If I was starting an NFL team and I could pick any player in NFL history, do you think I'm going to pick Tom Brady? Tom Brady is a hype job. I don't care how much he won. Watch the game that he played the game before last and watch how all of the calls went for him. Mm. Right. Watch other Super Bowls when he finds a way to get the ball back when the play is over. They throw a flag. Because, see, you can call holding and all that stuff any time in the NFL. Right. Because they holding every time. Right. And that motherfucker quarterback for the Chiefs, that boy's a bad motherfucker. I seen that nigga do a front flip and throw the ball and, and the nigga missed it. Said, damn, this nigga did a front flip? If they would have caught them passes, they would have been in the yeah. game. Because this motherfucker threw passes. That was unbelievable. I was and like, they, he, about, he got it to the motherfucker. Yeah. They talking about Tom Brady, but I thought that was cold. She niggas on TV talk about the Tom Brady is the greatest player ever. He good, though. ESPN nigga. I didn't say he wasn't good. Right. But yeah. don't ever say he the greatest. The, what? He the greatest quarterback. They talking about he better than Michael Jordan. When it no. comes to team oh, sport. No, nah, ain't the oh best team God. sport player Shut of all the fuck time up. is Bill Russell. I 11 championships. That's I, oh, you know why I can't give it to him? Why? The competition he was playing against ain't the competition Jordan played against. Mm. They only let a certain amount of black people be on each team. I, I'm taking Kareem over Jordan career-wise. Why Kareem over Jordan? Because Kareem had the best career, complete career of any basketball player ever. He won three championships in college. He won six in the league. 
he was the best player in basketball from the time he was a freshman in high school until maybe his 13th or 14th year in the league. Mm. Let's, let's say how good Kareem is, but when the Lakers won their first championship, Kareem was back in L.A. fucking bitches when they won the tournament in Boston. Right, he was hurt. Now, <laughs> he was hurt. He was hurt. Yeah. The Bulls wouldn't have won no championship without Michael Jordan. Uh, yeah, but Not they, one. They still went to Kareem the stayed at the crib because he <laughs> twisted his ankle or something. Right. Magic them won the ship in Boston. I'm, I prefer <laughs> I prefer MJ's playing style over Kareem's. But if we just go off the numbers and the accolades, Jordan can't fuck with Kareem. He can't fuck with him. Just as I much. just gave you a stat that's pretty hard to argue with. Kareem got six MVPs. He got six championships. He got three. They didn't need him. He got three championships. They won without him. He got three championships in college, so and he got four championships in high school. As a collective, it means something when the team win the championship without you. That's true. How you gonna put Kareem over Magic? Because Kareem, numbers wise, is undisputed. Numbers fool you, man. Not with Kareem, man. Kareem. Not with Kareem, huh? Kareem is the only nigga you can put. So if in you the had argument. a chance to pick, I'm gonna pick Jordan. No, let me ask you a question. Oh. If you had a chance, you starting a team, both of them at the same age, you gonna pick Kareem or Shaq? Which one are you gonna get? That's hard. It ain't hard. It's hard. You gonna get Shaq because young young Shaq was unstoppable. Young Shaq only gonna give you about ten solid years. Kareem had about. 17, 18 solid NBA years. I, I believe you, but why is Shaq playing while he young? Sha look, Shaq, if Shaq was with a whip. Shaq is the best player. If, if Shaq is healthy and focused, he the best player to ever play basketball. <laughs> and it ain't even close. I'm just talking about from a dominance perspective, 2000, 2001 Shaq, it ain't nobody that's ever played ball that can fuck with that Shaq. Not even MJ in his prime. I can't argue with that. It's hot to the motherfucker. Yeah, I was just going to say, Craig forgot to lower it. Remember when you turned oh, it on? Oh, yeah, my bad. Yeah. <laughs> he he, tur he look, turned it up to 80. <laughs> look, let me tell you something. He's trying to roast you out. Shaq and Jordan on the same level to me <laughs> when it comes to if you had to start an NBA franchise right. with one player, it would be between Shaq and Jordan. I agree. All day long. Jordan. Russell. I take my hat off to him. What's the other name? Wilt the Stilt? Wilt He'll the be third. Yeah, Wilt the Because he was the truth in any era. Definitely. Most definitely. I'm not saying Kareem ain't the truth in any era, but they won the championship without the nigga. Yeah, they did. I'd have been mad as hell. They did. I would have went to the game. I agree. And be like, just put me in for five minutes so I can say I played. <laughs> <laughs> Who? Yeah, I mean, Phil said something. We can't hear him. Say it loud. He got one without him. He got his second year in the league. He led Milwaukee to a chip. Average 34 and 17. What year was that? 71 or something. Yes, it does. <laughs> Phil said it don't matter what year it was. They only let niggas dominate the NBA after a certain amount of time. Great players are going to be great no matter what area you put them in. Everybody says that Steph Curry couldn't play back then. Oh. Definitely. Wow. That's Phil. That's Phil over there talking. Don't know what he's talking about with his Clippers ass. That nigga was saying the Clippers can't go be stopped. <laughs> That's terrible. Our best player got braids going to the back. Oh, I cannot. Somebody said Kobe better than Shaq. Look, let me tell you something, man. Kobe is a monster, man. When Kobe was playing with Shaq, he was watching Shaq. We're holding up that uh, 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 finals MVP trophy like this. But prime Shaq, <laughs> homie, prime Shaq. Nigga, remember Shaq's rookie year? Shaq as a rookie averaged 28 and 12. Hey, man, when Shaq came into the league, man, I'm talking about Hakeem Olajuwon. I'm talking about David Robinson. They was bouncing off him. I they never... was bouncing off him. Shaq, you gonna put Tom Brady over Shaq? Yeah, you wow. Uh... I know Shaq get big. He, you know what I'm saying? He, he fat. He couldn't, he couldn't get off them hoes at night. I'm, I, I got the same problem Shaq got. <laughs> Shaq and me used to see each other at night. Where you going? Yeah, I'm gonna go to the bitch house too. 
Stopping the Jack in the Box on the way to the crib. That's what stopped Shaq. Open Pepper, fast food joints. <laughs> Shaq would have been great for years if he ain't had that motherfucking... <laughs> He fucked hoes and ate fast food. That is the recipe for disaster. Oh, my God. If you go ball, you'll look just like him, too. Fuck out of here. <laughs> sexy than a motherfucker. Shaq ain't handsome. He got that slave baby face. Hey. Oh, my God. <laughs> Don't beat me up, Shaq, because oh I know you. Oh, my God. Well, let me tell you something. You don't know how big Shaq is you get up on that nigga. You be like, God, uh -huh. that Craig done cut the heat on hell and this motherfucker. I told him to. I was like, don't I forget. Turned it down. I forgot, I said, too. I said, how, how, how hot is it in here? He was I got like, on a motherfucking rat fur jacket. He yeah. turned that shit up to 80. Ain't never, ain't never got, ain't <laughs> cool out, ladies. Cool out, ladies. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 You see? Uh, <laughs> you got them old man muscles. <laughs> <laughs> hey, boy, you say I got old man muscles. The muscle. motherfucker drip when he stops. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got them shirts. What, I got shit on my face? Yeah, right on the Where? side. Right. What, what? Oh, yeah, you got a little something, something. Yeah, you missed the spot with that gray. You got them Shirley from Good Time Arms. <laughs> <laughs> Eating these motherfuckers yeah, yeah. chips and popcorn and shit. All right, fuck it. Yeah, it ain't never been nobody oh like God. Shaq, man. Ain't, you, but it ain't never been nobody like Al. Mm. See, motherfuckers really don't know how good Jordan was, man. Jordan came into the NBA and changed shit because mm. it was Bird and Magic League. Yeah. yeah. But when Al came in, dog, mm. it was over. What? Yeah. I never knew people rooted against the Bulls till I started traveling doing comedy. And I was in the airport. I was in Indianapolis, and mm. the Bulls won a playoff game. And I couldn't believe people was like, oh, man. <laughs> I was like, people root against Jordan? I didn't even know that. <laughs> <laughs> the man was unstoppable, man. Unstoppable. Shaq was, too. Man, Shaq. Yeah, you talk about some Tom Brady is the greatest ever. Get the fuck out of here, dog. I'm talking about, I'm saying, if you're going to start a national football team mm. and you can pick any other, any players you want from any era, are you going to pick Tom Brady first? That's what I want to know. Niggas who want a paycheck on ESPN will be like, yeah, I'm picking Tom Brady. Tom Brady is really the best player ever. He's the go. It depends on the era. If it's this era, I'm picking him first. If it's this run and gun era, but if we talking about 80s football where it's smash mouth and you got to have a big line and a running back, I'm not taking him first. I'm saying like, and you can pick any player from football. history, are you going to start with Tom Brady? <laughs> right, right. I'm not. Right, right. Do you know how much of a motherfucking impact Barry Sanders would have if he was on a good team? Mm. If Barry Sanders played for a good team, man, it would be... It was, oh my God! The man he couldn't be caught. How come Jordan couldn't win without Pippen? Well, Pippen happened to come when Jordan won, if you ask me. Mm. And Pippen was good enough to learn off Jordan. So you think he could have won with Orlando Woolridge if they would have kept Woolridge? <laughs> <laughs> no, Orlando Woolridge uh, motherfucker wore real fancy clothes and fucked hoes. <laughs> right. Pippen was ugly. He just bought pussy and was happy. Right. So he could practice. He was like, my pussy paid for. <laughs> but Pippen got better being around Jordan. I agree. The mentality Jordan had had him second to none. Yeah, Steve Kerr had got cut by the Orlando Magic and came over to Chicago. All you got to do is hit the open just shot if you're playing with air. Right. We need a motherfucker to hit the shot. I think Jordan would have been a serial killer if he didn't play sports. Yeah. That Because that's how motherfucking tormented he is about being the alpha and dominant nigga. Like oh, he you're has, basing off of the He has to be superior. Well, you need that drive to mm -hmm. be the best. Uh, only thing I got to say about Jordan, boy, them big ass blue jeans you be wearing, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, start your wardrobe over, hey. nigga. I don't know what the fuck you be wearing. This nigga wear bell bottom and he top want, jeans. He wants to be comfortable. Yeah. He got the wide leg. You know he got a Jinko uh, sponsored by Jinko jeans. <laughs> he what? Jinko. You never heard of Jinko yes, jeans? Yes, I Jinko. Them skateboard jeans they used to wear in the 90s where you couldn't see your shoes at the bottom. It kind of went all the way to the tip of yeah. the shoe. Yeah, that's funny as hell. Like no, 90s. what happened, that nigga, what, this is what happened. I was in the, out last year when I was at the Chicago, the NBA was in, they had the All-Star game. Mm -hmm. So the hotel I stayed at, a lot of the older players 
who, you know, was getting that award. They had some award show for the older players. All the older players still had their clothes from when they was playing. <laughs> That's their flavor. They, they like suits that. were still big and shit. I was like, y'all ain't got y'all, y'all ain't updated this shit. They got the new car <laughs> I'm talking about niggas who were yeah. six nine, had them big long trench coats, <laughs> but you could tell it's an older model trench coat. Yeah. I'm like, y'all gotta go spend that money, get that wardrobe updated. <laughs> I know y'all wasn't making the same money these guys making now. That's Barkley fault. Yeah. Barkley was bitching when they was getting motherfuckers $90 million out of college and shit. I just hate they how them that part, older yeah. players, that's all they talk about is Michael Jordan. You can't talk about how great nobody is without them bringing up Michael Jordan. You talk They're about still selling Jordans, though. Everything. Michael Jordan, Michael Jordan, but Kobe was cool, but Michael Jordan, you know, Michael Jordan, Michael, man, shut the fuck up, nigga. Hey, man, y'all ain't had nobody to... to, to, to be talking about LeBron. Kobe. Kobe LeBron, LeBron is good. He's better than Michael. He, LeBron is. They're going to be talking about him in the future like LeBron that. LeBron and Kobe better than MJ. If you say so. If you say so. Kobe, you know what I'm saying? I ain't taking nothing away from Kobe. Kobe was an offensive assassin. I'm talking about one-on-one -on -one unguardable. When he played on the Olympic team, because at first he didn't play, but when they got Kobe and motherfucking D-Wade, I was yeah. like, ain't nobody going to beat that squad. Yeah. No. Them two motherfuckers can't nobody guard. Right. Nobody in the world. Kobe or LeBron, real spit. Yeah. Well, LeBron was playing forward. His skills wasn't as developed then. Him and Carmelo, they was like, get y'all put ass down low. <laughs> Carmelo with your look, yeah, that, yeah, your braids look nice. Get down low and grab some boys. <laughs> they had D Wade and Kobe up top, and them yeah. other players from other countries. It was, it was a joke. I think they would have beat the Dream Team. They'd have went at it. They'd have went at it because, I, I mean, like. LeBron, Kobe, D. Wade, Carmelo on the same team. Yeah. I'm told that was back when Carmelo was still like had that bounce. Man, man. He was a problem. But another team that is not given its credit is when Russell Westbrook, Derrick Rose, and that other boy who played for Houston was young. Um, he a jump shot shooter, light skin from Chicago. Oh, uh, uh, anyway, me. man. These motherfuckers was faster than everybody in the Olympics. It didn't even look real. Oh, Derrick Rose. Right. When Derrick Rose and Russell yeah. Westbrook, yeah, that's when they right. was dribbling the ball down court, they beat the other white boys. They were hey. hurt. <laughs> I'm like, hey, motherfuckers are asleep on these motherfuckers. These motherfuckers, can't nobody beat them. Derrick Rose, I'm going to say some controversial shit. Derrick Rose is a better athlete than Michael Jordan. You could say stuff like that and, and nobody will be like, get the fuck out of here because Derrick Rose had freakish athleticism. I never Because he won but 6'2", doing all that. I never seen a nigga that small jump like that. See what I'm saying? Yeah, Derrick Rose. Did you see me argue? I didn't argue that. I, I, don't think, I don't think you could compare nobody to Jordan, but what I'm saying is when you say athleticism, yeah, Derrick Rose, I saw Derrick Rose one time in high school. I heard about him. Yeah. They said, you seen that boy at Simeon? I was like, who? I saw him play one game. I said, that's going to be the number one player picked when he come out of wherever. Yeah. That and that, that punk-ass coach, Calipari, was coaching Memphis then. And it was the year before Derrick Rose graduated from high school. And, and he said, well, we got a guy next year. When he gets here, we'll be in the Final Four. <laughs> and that's where the fuck they went. They should have won the whole motherfucking thing. Yeah, yeah. But... I forgot who they played. They played a real good team. But we talk about this sports shit. The main thing I want to say, Tom Brady is, come on, man. Tom Brady is a great quarterback. A great quarterback. But don't ever get to talking this best ever shit, man. It's too many talented motherfuckers that played in the NFL, man. We ain't even talking defense. Right. Man, let me tell you something, man. Ray Lewis was a motherfucking monster. Yeah, he was. Young Ray Lewis? Yeah. Are you fucking serious? So if I got a team and I got a chance to pick Tom Brady or Ray Lewis, I'm going to pick Tom Brady over Ray Lewis? <laughs> that's a tough one. Man, if you got a defense that's anchored by somebody like that who was holding down that whole middle, yeah. a motherfucker that big and that fast. No, Brady, right? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Not only will he murder you, but he'll get away with it. They ain't gonna find no evidence. <laughs> How about that? He was murdering niggas for real. That nigga got two bodies, nigga. And, and <laughs> Ray Lewis. Ray Lewis, I'm not picking no middle linebacker over Ray Lewis. Um, All that Erlacher shit. Erlacher was good, but what Ray Lewis used to do, man, cross that middle. If you know anything about football, 
you know how valuable it is to have a motherfucker like that yeah. on your defense. Yeah. He make other motherfuckers better because they like, shit, we got to step our game up. Greatest. This motherfucker Superman. LT is somebody said Lawrence Taylor. How you gonna put you gonna you gonna pick Brady over Lawrence Taylor? That's what I'm saying. Anybody fucking <laughs> I'm just asking. Anybody fucking with the yay, I can't be all the way invested in Just him, imagine man. that yay motherfucker used to hit him, he ain't even feeling it. <laughs> yeah, he didn't. Nah. He'd be like, boy, I'm about to buy a little girl after this over, nigga. <laughs> cool out LT, I'm just fucking with you. Don't run up on me. I'm taking I like I'll take Adrian Peterson over LT and uh oh boy though. Adrian Peterson, Adrian another Peterson. motherfucker who didn't win a Heisman. He's the best running they back. Gave, they gave the white boy quarterback from USC yeah. his Heisman. Yeah, Matt Leinart. Matt Leinart. Mm. Yeah, that was crazy. Fuck all that shit. I'm calling out all that bullshit. But first of all, we got to talk about this also. Let's put this out here. There are people in this world that you should be protected from being in a relationship with. Ooh. Let me say that again. There are people in this world, there's no way you should be in a relationship with them. It's a bitch! Gorilla glued her hair! Yeah, I, I cannot. I cannot. And they put the bitch back out there in public like this a regular bitch. <laughs> I didn't even know what she did. You know how you be scrolling on your shit? I just yeah. saw a bitch talking who eyes was bucked like this. I, I was like, who's that crazy bitch? I cannot. But after you see it 50 times, you be like, fuck it, let me see what happened. I just seen that. This stupid bitch! <laughs> Who the fuck gonna put Gorilla Glue in their hair? And then they put it back out here in society with and the then try to say, <laughs> And then try to say that she's gonna lawyer up. How the hell? Wait, you read the, you read the precaution. But she went a whole month and her hair didn't she fucking liked how it move. Looked. You went a whole month. I know how bad Before that bitch you... head stank. Oh, oh man. My... This bitch hey. did her hair like a weeble wobble. That's for all the old school niggas. <laughs> hey, but did she get, did they cut it off? Or did y'all know what happened with it? Well, yeah. she had a, a, whatever, was it the GoFundMe or whatever? Where no. the bitch was up to 15000 Well, what, happened, what happened was recently a, a Beverly Hills um, plastic surgeon said that he could help her out. He would do the pro procedure, which could cost anywhere from 10000 to 12000 is what he's kind of guesstimating. But I guess it didn't say anything about her, him paying for her to get here. So maybe she has to get herself here, but he put it out the there. I like what that bitch doing. That bitch is supposed to let that glue sit there until the hair under there finally push the glue up. But and start oh over God. from there. Yes, no. But you think she ain't gonna get no ink wrong hairs? That bitch needs some clippers for weeds. To cut her hair. They might have to. First of all, the bitch look crazy. They might, they might have to just. All on top of, and she about 40. She no. Old. Yeah, she older. What? Hell yeah. Old and dumb. Shit, yeah. Shit, yeah. What a fucking stupid ass bitch. How fuck you? Put, I'm going to use Gorilla Glue so I can lay this hair I hate down. Huh. I, I don't understand who don't know what the fuck Gorilla Glue is. Yeah, I knew what Gorilla Glue was when I was in elementary. When that Elmer's didn't work, you know, we used to have that Elmer's, that white glue? Yeah. yeah. Motherfucker wouldn't put something down, they go get that Gorilla Glue away. Ain't, ain't nothing gonna come loose from that motherfucker. Right well, there. now they have a spray Jeez. adhesive. Now that Gorilla Glue has a whole line of stuff, they even have a tape. They like to have a pretty serious, like, adhesive, this Gorilla Glue tape thing. It's pretty incredible. It's like clear, see through. What did wow. you use it on, D? What did I use it on? Yeah. A tailpipe. Tailpipe? Yep. Wow. <laughs> what do you mean? I did. I helped somebody out. I had some in my trunk, and you just gotta um, improvise. I might. I might donate. Exactly. It got them to where they needed to go. I might donate a dollar to her just so, cause you can say slick shit when you donate, right? <laughs> oh my. Here God. you dumb fuck bitch. You don't think she's hearing all that? I don't care what she hear, bitch. You stupid. That bitch, she's a, she's a TikToker. Why is she washing her hair? That bitch glue her phone to her ear. Her name's <laughs> Tasika Brown. Don't Tasika say the whole Brown. name. Now we put the bitch out there. Well, she's got herself out. She's a TikTok oh, yeah. fame oh, yeah. girl. She she's up on TikTok. She's about 700,000 followers on, on that. That's Instagram. what she's doing at all. She did that. She, you know? she did it for TikTok. Yeah. I mean, we gonna talk shit, but the bitch brilliant. The bitch glued her hair to come up. That bitch hit a lick shit. on the glue side of the game. She don't know shit. She don't know what the, know what the uh, after effects is there. It is, though. It don't matter, man. Niggas are fucker because people know her. Nigga, do you know how many ugly, famous bitches I done fucked? Well, I mean, I hit one. 
You ain't gonna say who. She crazy. She's what show she played on? Uh, she ain't play on no show. She's a rapper. Right. She's a rapper. You remember? Uh, you uh, remember No Limit Records? You ain't fuck me. Don't okay, me. you know Mercedes from No Limit Records. Uh, why the hit Mercedes? I hit Alexa. Oh, here we go. I knew it. I knew I could see the build up. I could see the build up. I know because the bitch had a taint tattoo on her titty. She was a no limit soldier. Shout out to Alexis. I, I was finna fuck this rapper bitch. That bitch got me. This was a long time ago when I was a broke nigga in Houston working just joking comedy club. See, I, I'm scared to say a name because it'll give her too much fame, but <laughs> the bitch let me eat a pussy and then answer oh. the phone and say she gotta go. <laughs> God, you fucking bitch! I was like, that motherfucker finna have to wait, bitch. That was before I had a car, so Jeez. she drove me back to my little oh, pussy ass hotel and put me out the car. Man, Said, I gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go. You got me She's fucked bad. up. She wasn't no was bad bitch, it's just she was famous yeah. for a minute. She, You know, some of them rappers, they only be famous for a minute. Yeah, yeah. She from Houston. I can figure that one out. <laughs> Somebody said, oh, no, hell no, that ain't what they said. Somebody said Queen Latifah. I ain't eating Queen Latifah oh, pussy. I, 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 so I eat her pussy, why I not? I slid up so fast on that bitch. It ain't been no dicks in that Jeez. motherfucker. It's clean as a motherfucker. Who? Queen Latifah pussy? She ain't got no dick residue on her I would at least dipped in that pussy. You had me fucked up. Yeah, I, 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 I'm hitting the queen. You can keep you can keep the Jordans and jeans on all that shit. I'm hitting that pussy queen. <laughs> uh, yeah. What if queen. she had her hair braided to the back like uh, in that movie? I'm hitting queen. I'm hitting. I'm hitting. I'm hitting that pussy, man. Craig, one thing I will say that you ain't never had <laughs> no shame go. about. Yeah, it. Hey, Craig will fuck an uh, average bitch. I, in a heartbeat. Average Joe. That should be yeah. your nickname. Corey like bad bad bitches. I'm not on Corey level. I don't I'm, like all bad bitches. I got some bitches out here that's just flat out not presentable. <laughs> oh my I done God. seen them too. Yeah, so. <laughs> oh my lord. <laughs> you know, hey, came on. Nah, so, so you think you let her get away with that because you were famous? What else could I do? Did somebody say her name? No, that wasn't it. See, I'm, I'm so... What, did somebody say the name? Oh, no, I thought somebody said it. But it, it, she old school. She was out for a minute. No, nope. I'm so glad they don't remember her. She had like two hits. Damn, somebody said it. <laughs> I'm too scared to say who said it. Oh, we'll go back to the cover. They said Leslie Jones. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> Who the fuck Corey is Daddy Gates? <laughs> Who? Who? Daddy Gates, how the fuck you know? <laughs> <laughs> that nigga got it. Daddy Gates got Cause it. Because that, that could be her. You know this is a... The people do this where they that act like... bitch ain't got no motherfucking TV nowadays. That bitch out here bad. Oh, stop. <laughs> that could be anybody. They I don't fuck with hoes no, with no future. I fuck with bitches, bitches who None motherfucking of those people out have their here real names bad, nigga. Niggas out here motherfucking laughing at me. What's the fuck most famous broad you hollered at but it didn't really work out? What? What's the most famous broad you tried to holler at? Hey man, I be fucking them hoes, man. I ain't even <laughs> oh, that lie, to all this. Yeah. Bitches be giving me pussy, I just I don't tell lie. anybody. I yeah, tried that's to... not very tasteful okay. right there, Craig. You would? I'm just, I'm just talking about trying to holler at. I'm not saying it happened. You, you smell. I, thought I you, tried to holler oh, at I Beyonce. I thought you just asked him if he did. You tried to holler, tried to holler at Beyonce. Yeah, of oh. course I wasn't successful I, at Roscoe's Chicken and Waffles on, on Gower. What did you say to her? Man, I was a coward that day. I walked up on her. But they were already Destiny's Child. Huh? It was Destiny's Child, yeah. I tried to get that collar print. I caught her, nigga. I was, huh? You tried Gotta to get give her? it up to you, though. See, that they Kyle like that. Print. Some women like that. I tried. Like, oh, look, oh, she look was him. standing outside of Roscoe's. Remember Some nigga said, flame. Fuck you, nigga. <laughs> 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 I said, I ate Lizzo pussy. Fuck y'all, uh, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Kelly Price. She was fuck Kelly you, Price. Bro. No, she not a rapper. You're I can't Kelly. fuck Kelly Price. Her head too big. I don't like bitches with big heads. That's one thing. Oh. I got a big head. I don't want no bitch with no big ass head. That's hilarious, nigga. <laughs> Big face bitches, I don't fuck with them for real. It depends. It depends. She's Japanese and black. She ain't got no choice but to have a big wide ass head. <laughs> but they be pretty though when they mix oh, with yeah. Asian. You know. Oh, fuck out of here. Not Japanese. Japanese got the little heads, right? Oh my. God. You talk about Koreans. Koreans, yeah, you're right. right. You're right. Yeah, Koreans, yeah. some big face motherfuckers. Yeah, they, yeah, yeah. The big face. face. Be fine, the motherfucker though. Oh yeah, you like them Asian? And, I like yeah, the Spanish and black. I like them that too, but yeah. them blazers, but when you find you one that, what? 
do specific features. Right, right. Ooh. Spanish girls got too they much family. You, they said you fuck. <laughs> they, hey, they said you fuck <laughs> boss. Remember the rapper, the boss? <laughs> Who was that? I forgot. Who was that? No. You remember the female? She was the stud rapper she in the mid '90s. She was. Nah, right. Corey fucked that one. I rock rough and tough with my. I fuck. Up. That's oh, rage. rage. I fuck rage. Rage, yeah. rage yeah. thick as a motherfucker. Rage actually a cute girl. Yeah, rage is yeah. nice looking. She just yeah. got that weight on her a little bit. I don't keep the weight, rage. I take the pussy all day long. My name is oh, Sage. My God. Yeah, I like yeah. rage. <laughs> You know who I used to jack off to when I was a youngin? I don't know, you was already an adult, but but D from the Wayans Brothers. When she was being that security outfit, nigga, her ass was so fat. Ah, like the older sister. Yeah. That's sister. She got a hell of a body. Her Boy, body is crazy, that's the nigga. Sister. That's, that's the only sister. one. Uh huh. She's the only girl in the Get family. Get the fuck out of here. On the camel side of the game, but she thick as hell. She oh, thick as a motherfucker. Oh. Ass like a motherfucker. And boy. I think she's a great actor. Yeah, she's, the, she's, she's funny. A, she's talent, yeah. a great talent. She's a great talent. Hey, man, on that movie, Low Down, Dirty Shame, when they said she won that shit, she was like, oh. <laughs> 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 I like she good. That girl good. <laughs> they're, they're I discovered her on clock. 227. That's when I became aware of how big her booty was. Not 227. Amen. Oh. I used to fall for that big booty shit. I mean, big booty look nice, but I don't fall for that shit no more. That is not the basis of me fucking with you. Because I done had some motherfucking big booty bitches who motherfucking, I know they ain't, they, like, I never thought about how big booty bitches will give you a big booty son. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, you talking about Clayton Thomas? That's fucked up, man. <laughs> <laughs> Get his ass, Clayton. That's my nigga. <laughs> I don't play with Clayton. That's the Clayton, homie. Clayton is a nice guy, but when you make him mad, he be like, no. Oh. <laughs> he put the glasses down a little bit. He put yeah. the glasses down. Clayton is a plotter. He's a plotter and a planner. That nigga be sending emails about you. He gonna get you. He ain't gonna let you win. Clayton, we love you. Come I love Clayton, Clayton man. We love you, Clayton. Clayton, one of them niggas. Oh, shit. Oh, I knew oh, it. Man. Look what you did, D. What the fuck? That's always me. Damn, I hate that shit. That's what you get. Uh, I knew that was gonna happen. Uh, Fuck! That drink was looking, shit. It was I, looking too pretty. And I just asked him. I was like, Phil gonna go get some of them big ass napkins in the back. <laughs> oh, you can't. No, oh, 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 nigga. Oh, oh. Yeah. Wait, he bumped his head. No, but he was close to the phone. Hey, Phil. Hey, Phil gonna take his he gonna take his crap. Craig showed me some highlights of Phil. Uh oh. Back in high school days, Phil was a Phil's real on. bona fide superstar. Yeah, Phil should have went to the league. That he, plastic he, thing, because it's underneath. Hey, now. Phil about to go take his pamper off and use it to wipe up the table. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucked up, Phil. You gonna come and uh, get you in a headlock right there, Jay? I ain't fucking with Phil, yeah. man. Hell yeah, Phil that, got that. That paper towel that turned into your cover shirt. Yeah, come yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, that motherfucker. Uh -huh. Come on, Phil. It don't matter if you've seen, if you want to. Yeah. Come on, Phil. They want to see. Let everybody see who Phil is. Phil, come on. Just say hi, Phil. Don't be shy, goddammit. Come say um, hi behind Craig, Phil. Hi, Phil. You probably need a... Uh, uh, oh, here. Put he's, it in here, Phil. He's part of the family. I don't need, I don't need this shit no more. Yeah, Put that shit up in there, dog. It smells. D, you talking about smells. You, oh, you don't want this no more? I ain't gonna eat it. Fuck. It stinks. Tell the story about how you got uh, jumped by the whispers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 they was yelling. Big, feeling yeah. this bitch about to waste the ice all over the floor. Y'all can't scoop the ice up. Just scoot it in the in the. I was gonna say you want me to get it, but I don't. Green want to giant. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> stupid. You know I'm good with the research. I, you know I found high school footage of Phil. Yeah. yeah. You seen it? Uh-uh. Nigga had crazy What high school? Game. Phil, you were here? Uh, Phil had a shag in high school. <laughs> Phil, Phil, on the Peebo Bryson yeah, side. Yeah, they had them little bit of shorts on. Yeah. Yeah. Like Peebo Bryson. Yeah, for real. Yeah. He had the boxer shorts on. Right. Phil played in the McDonald's All-American game with Magic Johnson. Oh, shit. Yeah, he the same. Oh, OK. My you, bad. All right, so let me say some shit to get me black ball. Oh, oh, shit. So I'm sitting there watching the internet, and my good, oh, I don't know him, but I am a, a fan. I think he is a great actor. Mm. And from everything I have seen about him, he seems like a really stand-up guy. Will Smith. Right. Will Smith had a mm -hmm. nigga with titties at his crib. Who? Lil Nas X. Yeah. Nas X. Was out there while they was he hooping. Took, he took that picture while he was at his house? I don't know where he took that oh. picture, but 
First of all, Nas X got titties. It can't no nigga with titties come in my house. Do he really got titties? No, I think that was fake. Uh, I don't care what it is. Yeah. If you have titty <laughs> pictures out there like that, <laughs> I ain't fucking with you, nigga. Can't have no titties and fucking be with me, nigga. <laughs> the fuck out of here, nigga. This nigga got titties. <laughs> we'll probably be able to put them on. I don't know. I think Nas X like that shit. He's just a nigga who like boys. Nah, it's open with it. He, oh, he, he wide open. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah, he, he wide open for real. Oh <laughs> what is what is what is the deal with men sleeping with men? Like, I don't understand. Like, dick in the ass is already something. I look at bitches like, you want me to do that? Right. <laughs> I don't understand the asshole fetish at all. I mean, sometimes you fuck with an asshole if it's a girl. You don't ever touch a girl's assholes. You ain't never put your Listen, thumb in man. the middle of ass while you doing it? Listen, man. Shit exit there. Yeah. So my dick ain't entering now. You know what I mean? All I think about is shit. Mm-hmm. When I think about ass. Who out there? Phil. Oh. I don't know why he went around. That's all I think, I think about lot, when I think about ass is shit. Lot. That's what shit exit. Don't let him fold it into Who do you think exit a vagina? Do you think? Piss. Piss. Do you think Piss. only piss come out these Piss. motherfucking... Piss. Blood. Wick voucher I'm food. I'm a vampire, nigga. But I ain't, got, I ain't no shit. I, I, I ain't got shit to do with shit. I ain't fuck with no shit. No, nigga, shit ain't nothing worse than shit. If you eat a pussy and won't eat the rest of the shit, <laughs> you're not gonna eat ass. I eat ass all day. I'm eating ass. Oh, he likes getting to go without saying. Nigga, you eat ass, nigga. I said I ate ass. <laughs> but it ain't normal for niggas like me. I draw a line right here. Right here. The, the, you ain't eating no ass? I draw a line, nigga. I draw a line. Let me see This nigga eat everything but the ass. What a fucking hypocrite. <laughs> <That's crazy. laughs> this nigga eat roadkill but not ass. How the fuck you do that? <laughs> <laughs> I'm eating ass. I don't give a fuck. Nigga, if you eat pussy and don't eat ass, nigga, you have doing it. It real spit. You just got to eat the ass after you eat the pussy because you don't want to contaminate the pussy. You know what I'm saying? Not you. Man, not my little Muslim brother. It. What? No, I'm just saying. <laughs> have you ever ate an ass? I've never ate ass. Yeah. See, they need his diet. The only know why you ass. He's Muslim. You know what he's doing? I'm a market. Shit. Yeah. Let me tell you why. Look, I believe you, Mark. I believe you, Nayel. All right. When it comes to doing perverted, freaky shit like this, you have to have accepted life won. What? You got to accept what? The life won. Once you realize life won, life ain't shit, you going to eat a bitch ass. Life ain't gonna defeat me like that. No, it's just you eat a dead animal but not a live ass. I'm pescatarian, first of all. Oh, when well, you eat a dead fish. Fish are cannibals. You're not oh. supposed to eat cannibalistic animals. You goddamn lie. Fish eat fish, yeah. nigga. That is they disgusting. Do. Listen, he finna make excuse for it. Right. Watch this. <laughs> Listen, man, I eat salmon. Salmon is good, clean fish. Let me tell you about oh, something about salmon, no. whether you notice or not. They are creating salmon because of the demand for salmon. They have salmon that grow to market size in a couple of weeks. They never put them in the ocean because it might grow bigger than the whales because of the shit they put in there. Salmon will be the motherfucking shit that eat up everything in the ocean if they put that shit in there. You are eating chemicals. Eat some ass and make people happy. Straight up. Mm-hmm. It's beneficial to me. The little salmon, that ass ain't got no benefits to it's it. It's got good bacteria in it, nigga. What the fuck you talking that about? That bacteria fuck you up. Do you want a bitch to catch you up on your bill? I read a nigga. <laughs> no, just say Marcus is not for I read, you. I read a nigga got throat cancer eating ass. No, just say it's not for you because, uh, you know. Yeah, so are you pussy. saying a motherfucker can't get cancer eating pussy? Huh? That's what, that's what Michael Douglas claimed. Pussy gave is yeah. piss, boy. If you suck piss, don't discriminate on the shit. Okay. But but man. but the man can do whatever he Piece wants to do to, to each his own. Though. Everybody's not everybody's got their you know. Yeah, you before we put you on the spot. Excuse me. <laughs> we talking about eating ass. <laughs> you from L.A. Here we go. Do you we like go. you like eating your ass? Yeah. I don't talk about my. Did my definitely ass. She eat ass. <laughs> <laughs> she lifted some bars up and ate some ass. <laughs> 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 
That's just that's private. You guys can fantasize. You can fantasize all you like. It ain't nothing. I'm gonna admit it. When I was young, that's a good one, Marcus. That's my trigger for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't want to see this thing bend all the way back right now. You didn't got your rusty trombone on before, dude. <laughs> that was a good one. You got to put your nose in the pussy and eat the oh, ass that God. way. I promise oh, you. Man, it just they gonna tell you. disgusting. No, you practice your jaw muscles, have a bitch sit on your head yeah. with your tongue in her ass. What? I what? Can't. I got to put that on the line nothing, right there. See, there's nothing sexy about that when they hey, talk about it. Yeah, put that on yeah, the line. Tell you, man. Fuck that, man. They're not Cause sexy. Because what if I get a hit of shit on my goddamn tongue? A bitch sent four emails on my head. Huh? <laughs> Somebody sent a bunch of doo doos on the thing. She had a bitch sent four emails while she was sitting on his head. That's <laughs> pussy ain't enough. I'm going to tell you, you bitches know pussy ain't enough. That's why they use dildos. It's got to be more than the pussy. I ain't even trying to put my finger in her ass. Is I it won't... gay if you eat pussy with a dildo in the bitch? <laughs> If your mouth touch an artificial oh, stick, we gay. They talk a, all they want. They just talk. What? They had a, a two and a quarter. Song. <laughs> uh, he said, "How you gonna do that? You got to be creative with people. What if you, a people get tired of your you, little so same you would, old shit, but you'll do a little vibrator. The, the little vibrator do it." Yeah, I, I put a vibrator on a bitch's clit and eat her pussy. Why not? Fuck it. That ain't the question Guys that was asked. Guys talk too much about what they do. Niggas dodging. Oh, the question is What would you do if you was eating some, you were sucking on some pussy and you suck real hard and the dildo came out? <laughs> <laughs> Cause a lot of niggas that know you don't eat pussy, you suck pussy. A lot of niggas that don't, they don't know that. They, you know, eating pussy is is, a, is not the right term for it. You suck on pussy. All the real players What'd know that. What you do if you run up one of them bitches with the big ass clits? I'm not fucking with her. You play that motherfucker like a fiddle while you <laughs> while you fucking them. <laughs> big clit, bitch. Thank you, Bitch, Tony. if you don't get your nose clit having ass out of here, you're right. I heard about that story. You know they got bitches got dildos that they can turn up the temperature like a hot dick. They can put hot dick in them now. This ain't plastic. What? They can put hot dick in them now. The broke bitches be sitting on microwave dildos. <laughs> <laughs> got four of them on deck in some boiling water. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. They use that, yeah. they use no that little rose that. thing yeah. right now. Woman, next time oh you masturbate, God. nigga, put it, put the glove you use, with put it in the microwave. Really? Beat off with a warm glove. You thank me no next time you do it. Nigga, what? The best thing ever. <laughs> no, you pour hot water on your dick when you're nothing. There's, ain't nothing like that. You a cuss any bitch. Bitch, I don't need you. We got hot water in you. Yeah. 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 Really? Warm, you know. Marcus hot. knew he thirty. He ain't figured out all this yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk about he don't need ass, nigga. Ass, nigga. Right. Take that hat ass. off, nigga. You next need time, ass, nigga. Next time you eat pussy, drink some hot chocolate. Get your tongue real hot. Bitch gonna go crazy. I ain't never heard of that. Stuff. <laughs> 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 that nigga just <laughs> gonna burn that bitch. <laughs> you telling me a hot tongue won't do good for a pussy? Thanks, Nicky Bank. Nick Bank. <laughs> gave forty nine dollars, <laughs> and I yeah. need every dime, nigga. That's amazing. That's great. I Buy a pocket pussy. I need to figure out where that money go. Yeah, uh-huh. They're taking 40% of that shit. They if, cold, if they donate $10, you're getting $6. No, well, they, they take 30%. Okay. They oh, take, they yeah. take oh that's crazy. Oh, they raped oh, you they on dirty. YouTube, nigga. YouTube ain't shit. And you still got to pay the taxes. Oh, so you're really getting... Yeah. No. You're really getting three dollars out of it, or four dollars out of it. And they got every, and they got, you know, they got it all down. They got every uh, record of they it. They say you dress like a sex addict. Who me? I love fucking. I I ain't nothing wrong with being a sex addict. Keep fucking while you're still young, cause I'm telling you, all you niggas who still eat wings and beer, your dick gonna start breaking. <laughs> mm. <laughs> that dick starting to go bad. Yeah. I already know. The medicines you're taking and shit, that's why your father and your mama always arguing. He can't fuck it no more. <laughs> it's just everybody don't say that. That's some real shit. The only pussy, every once in a while you meet a bitch who pussy that works for you. And that's who you be with. It's something about, like you'll meet a girl like your dick don't work all the time. 
You, but you will meet a bitch when you be like, damn, it work with you. And you be like, she be like, what is you talking about? You be like, you don't know what I be through with these other bitches. <laughs> you ever heard this new shit called Royal Honey? What's that? That's new to you, oh, nigga. Oh, no, Show he new did not. booty ass. What's it called? Oh, Royal Honey. You don't know about that shit? Ro I don't it don't know. work. What is it? Don't work? I said it don't work after a while. But use it while it work. It's been around for a long time. It's called I'm Royal Hundred. Honey. Hundred. Dude, Royal Honey. Like Royal your honey. shirt. Yeah. <laughs> what, yeah, what this, is, I don't understand. This, they say that motherfucker had you in that motherfucker's goddamn be stone cold. What does this day say? You huh? used it before? I ain't no used it. What the fuck are you talking about? about some shit. Use it Who told weekend? you about it? Dave Lucas? What <laughs> <laughs> yeah. in the world? This <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, is a bad motherfucker, boy. They say you got to be going them for go rounds in that motherfucker. It's called oh. Royal Honey. Royal Honey. Be in the gas station. I'll give you a pill that will motherfucking change your life. The rhino pill. But this ain't this kind of natural right here. You know, I'm be fucking with yeah. that. You, you got that shit gonna bust my heart out. Nigga, you got a fucking That's earring true. in your ear. What are you talking about natural? <laughs> 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 That's true. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is this nigga? You don't get your Isaac Hayes face ass out of here, nigga. He got upset at me. Like, don't do Whoever you got all mad at me. I like Isaac Hayes. He got all oh, mad at me. Man. When I was like, you look like a young Isaac Hayes, he got all offended. I was like, that's not the a bad man. motherfucker. Like yeah. Isaac Hayes. Except yeah. Isaac Hayes was better. So bad motherfucker. You said Isaac Hayes looked better. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Well, as a kid, he used to fuck them hoes with that deep voice. Hey, man. He had a voice like yours, but people understood what he said. <laughs> 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 fuck you, that big-ass overbite. <laughs> <laughs> what did he say out of here? Yeah, big-ass big overbite. 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 Oh. You sneeze, you gonna bite yourself in the Watch chest. Watch like Denzel. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that picture Denzel took at the Pacquiao fight when he, when he was drunk? <laughs> <laughs> I love that picture, Denzel. I love it. Oh, <laughs> I don't give a fuck what nobody said about me. I like when motherfuckers dog me out. I don't give a fuck what I got caught doing. Whatever. Whatever, nigga. Anybody walked in on you with sex yet? Hell yeah. That is some motherfucking shit right there. Oh, yeah. My daddy called me uh, fucking this bitch when I was, in, uh, when I was young in high school. The nigga walked in and was like, set the bitch out. <laughs> he closed the door and shit, called me and shit. Was like, man, get that bitch up out of here, man. She stank. You oh, lie. <laughs> <laughs> now, this girl, this, this girl daughter called me like she was around about eight, and I didn't stop. I was just looking at her. Like, oh, <laughs> what? Oh, Ew, you that's pervert. Wild. That's what? a pervert <laughs> move. Oh. And she said something. I was like, oh. It don't say nothing about, <laughs> about you, that you got to stop fucking if, if kids walk in. You got to get the kids used to the shit you grown made folks do. You made eye contact with the kid, though. Yeah. Hey, let's, let's I wasn't it. flirting with the little girl, but I wanted to yeah, see me. I wanted why? her to see me why fuck her mama. That don't even sound right. Oh, no, no, that man. don't sound right. That so don't she could stop good. wondering what's happening when we close the door. That doesn't sound right. I did, I did yeah. some fucked up shit, though. Like, her son would sleep on the uh, us out of the bed. Oh. Yeah, I done did that too. That, yeah. that, we all did that. Yeah. Fuck, what, if she don't give a fuck, I don't give a fuck. Yeah. You know the baby yeah. in the bed? I ain't right, fuck it. Yeah, right. That's a baby. They can't really comprehend anything. But eight years fuck. old. They kept rolling over and she would stop. Mm, baby's a different story. They don't even know what <laughs> So eight years old is worse than a baby? Yes, baby doesn't even know what the hell is going on. Just right. Like, just thinks it's getting rocked to sleep, but the uh, little girl, <laughs> the little girl, eight years old, walking and seeing that, that sounds sense. like Somebody scary. say I'm a sex offender because I'm fucking exactly, her mama. Exactly, yeah. I was fucking her mama in her bed. That little girl ain't had no business waking up in the middle of the night. My thing is, how you... How you Did how her you? mama know she, she came? When, once her mama realized, I played it off. Like, oh, that... <laughs> <laughs> this nigga fucked up, <laughs> <laughs> That's what's up. She needs some milk. I'm gonna get your goddamn ass. I'm out here. <laughs> Country ass shit. Get your goddamn ass. Right. Stupid. <laughs> Fuck it. We gonna go on here. That little girl future. Yeah, she's not. Tell what she's doing right now. She's doing what her mama was doing. They always wind up doing what their mama do. It's just they always, some some will even denounce their mama, but they do the same thing their mama do. Probably the street walker. You never know. Working the blade. 
After that, go. she's been, she probably got, she was sexualized. In other words, she saw that. She probably so got. So you at that age, Marcus, where you still fuck with young girls. I'm at an age where I fuck with girls this young and old. <laughs> oh, I fuck with them cougars too now. But father. I fuck with my See, fucking that's old to you, nigga. I know. Forty <laughs> is a cougar? Yeah, forty. Yeah, that's where they start. That's the yeah. I'm thirty nine, like a motherfucker. Bro. Yeah, you you thirty nine? Yeah, yeah, you. So you'd have to mess with like you. You almost a sugar daddy. My birthday was on last Thursday. He got oh, you about nine years. Oh, we missed it, Craig. Right? How old are you? Happy birthday. I'm thirty two. Oh, you thirty two? You ain't but motherfucking seven yeah. years, eight years behind a nigga. Yeah, yeah you right behind. See, me. I'm fifty one. Oh. I ain't got no shame to my age. I don't give remember. a fuck. No, I remember. It's yeah. not a D before I yeah, see your age. There you go. I like, knew I'm about it. 51, I knew 50. it. I knew it. I'm going to get a text <laughs> Nursing right home now. ass out of here, dude. Damn it. I lost the bet. I lost the bet. <laughs> what? No, nothing. Somebody told me you were going to call me something. It happened. Okay. <laughs> but she said something slick to me. <laughs> Didn't you? <laughs> yeah. Doesn't he matter. forgot his age. Doesn't matter. That really? should make that me go. That to shut up. Uh, okay. Somebody okay. said, Corey, 51, y'all. Yeah, I'm an old nigga, nigga. I moved out here in 2000. I can't believe these years flew by that fast. Yeah, you yeah, 30. You, you'll be able to tell. 30 when I moved out here, I was fucking only bitch. When I was yeah. broke, them was the happiest days of my life. You'll be able to tell how old that nigga is if he ain't cover his hair and his teeth. Right. Yeah. Motherfucker, this hair died. But I'm sexy, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> I dyed my shit for the first time. He's confident. Time ago, He's yeah. confident. You need to dye that line in beige. Nigga, you dyed your hair? <laughs> oh, you did. Let's see, Craig. That's the first thing. <laughs> no, I'm sad. Just, you no. need to have some the line in that same color as your shirt on your head right there, nigga. What's <laughs> off pink on your head, nigga? That's peach. He's, yeah. He turned that same color when he get to laughing. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh that's funny. Yeah, red, yeah. red peach flavor. <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> Motherfucker said Corey was beating choice pussy up. Motherfucker, I didn't get the pussy, nigga. I got played. We all got played. Everybody ate some pussy and got ghost. Choice? You don't know a nigga. She, know, she, you was, you wasn't even born. Not or you was just born when she first came out. I don't care. Out. I'm proud. I'm proud of my age. What D say? I said no. I'm proud of my age. Somebody's like, oh, D don't want to know. How old are you, D? Oh, I will be 54 this month. D be turning oh, up nigga. Wow. Like, she be turning her neck like she had an injury. Thank you, Abraham. Well, get you a Diana Ross tattoo on your ass. Mm -hmm. Oh, she mm -hmm. ain't bad. I do my tendon. I have her? um surgery That's on her? Thursday. Back when she was, yeah. Who? You said you did? And let me tell you something Thursday, about that girl. She got oh, major yeah. game. Do she? Like, I don't know where she at, but she need a talk show. That's mm -hmm. when you had that, that's when you had that snogger tooth. Yeah, back when I had a chip tooth. Oh, that's how she got you. Yeah. Yeah. You were yeah, that must have I was been fucking more hoes when I had a chip tooth. That must have been a Chicago nigga, thing. Nigga, let me tell you something, nigga. It wasn't a Chicago thing. Well, everybody from Chicago's front teeth was something's wrong with it. <laughs> <laughs> am I, am I not right? <laughs> Everything got beat up in high school from Chicago, nigga. So I fell and bust <laughs> my shit. See, ah. see they, oh, were, right. they were uncoordinated. I looked in that mirror, I was like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> but after a while, I got used to it. <laughs> you just sported this Remember Nas shit, shit was chill? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's true. Who? Nas. Nas. The rapper Nas. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that's that. That's the original Nas, not the gay Nas from y'all. <laughs> yeah, y'all know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah I done ate a pussy, too. Choice is all right. Choice was all right, and yeah. I like to hear her talk. It very, every once in a while, I could listen to a woman talk. Yeah. When she used to be talking, I used to be like, man, this bitch got some game. Come find me, Choice. What's happening with you? You done fell off? You a big bitch now? You gotta keep yourself together like this. Oh, Lord, no. Oh, God, no. Look don't at that. Don't be fucked look, up. Look, she done look, died. Look, look. You know what I'm talking about? That's an old school. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Motherfucker, nigga. That's an elderly nigga show. <laughs> that person keeps walking your back and forth, back and forth. Nigga. Nigga. Somebody right. said, Corey be sitting on everybody. Denzel t fans can't help it. <laughs> Fuck you, Mike Smith. <laughs> y'all niggas, look, I want y'all to talk about me. I like it. Long as y'all, you ain't disrespectful if you meet me in person, we good. But no, I, well. I don't care about the chat room. I'm one of the niggas who wanted. I was the motherfucker who said, motherfuckers be blocking motherfuckers in chat rooms because they can't stand what they say. Right. I don't block chat rooms. I am very proud. Only I don't like that gay shit. 
I don't like when motherfuckers be talking that gay shit. That shit make me mad now. I ain't even gonna lie, because yeah. you might get bold enough to say that shit. You see me, Corey, you a fag. And then I'll be like, there be some weird niggas in the chat room saying some weird Did y'all see Tyler? Like I said, it's not really, you don't know who's saying what, because it's just, it's Like just, niggas be having fantasies or something, man. No, like, no, it, let me tell you something. It be motherfuckers trying yeah. to send you off. Yeah, they yeah. want to set you off, and it could be could be your girl, could be somebody mad. People don't understand. I don't give a goddamn what they say on that motherfucker. What right, long, long as when you see me, I, I ain't gonna buy you no drink, homie. No, if, you, <laughs> if I feel like you super disrespectful, I'll be like, you're doing too much, my nigga. Cool mm -hmm. out. Mm -hmm. But I never had those problems. Nobody walk up to me and talk crazy to me, really, in public. You want me to tell you who walk take or talk crazy to me, bitches? Cause they motherfuckers take advantage of their gender. They know if I super sock they ass, everybody gonna be like, Corey, you shouldn't have did that. <laughs> Just like they do with most people. If they feel like you bigger than them, then you can't say nothing about it. You know how many people be on my shit talking about, Corey, you know you supposed to apologize about what you did. I be like, who the fuck is this goofy ass nigga? Shut the fuck up, bitch ass nigga, and watch the show, nigga. You ain't got shit else going for you in life. That's, That's what we here for, to help you co cope with your life's failure. Real spec. Yeah. We done all fucked up. We never live up to our potential because we depressed. We can't fuck the bitches we want to fuck. Niggas coming through fucking your mama, closing the door and leaving with a tip of the hat. <laughs> that shit destroys <laughs> you, nigga, as you grow up in life. That's why I'm glad me and my mom... Oh, my mama and daddy were together when I was coming up. Yeah, mine. Oh, yeah? They still together? Oh, yeah. They was, they was together when I was coming. They stayed to... to what about up. now? You and your mom still together? Nah. Now? He said you and your mama still together. I'm just asking. I mean, no, I said you and your mom. You and your, <laughs> your, your dad. Your mom is no, not married no, fuck, no more. No, fuck no. They, she, she stayed until... The kids all were growing up. Yeah, yeah, all the kids came Then she left. She was like, fuck yeah. this shit. Yeah. I told her, I, I don't know why you did that shit. You should have... I've said this before on the show. Me and Marcus' mom is the same age, right? Here you go with this shit. Here we go. <laughs> Do that shit to fuck with him. Yeah, yeah. Cause Marcus' mama is mad cool. Very like she cool. Is straight, Very sweet. Straight, real, down to earth person. Mm -hmm. So it's like uh, when I go to Marcus' house, I always be like, "Is your mom here?" And I try to be respectful and everything. <laughs> but I'm gonna send Marcus on a gig out of town. And uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> What's her name? Because I just called her Marcus' mama. What's her name, Mark? Your mom? Uh, Not the only. What's your mom's name? Jonay. She's Jonay. so sweet. No, she comes to the restaurant often. We always have a good chuckle. Respectful yeah. woman. Yeah. I You're love her. Nice. She. When we, we was out there in Little Rock. Nice. Um. Um. I was performing at the Little Little Club. What's the name of the club? Uh, Nut House Comedy Lounge. Nut House Comedy Lounge. I was happy because I hadn't seen your mom in a while. I was happy to see. I met your mom and some more of your family members. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna start. A, I'm gonna finish start a vlog, man. I'm gonna do a little vlog. I was I was thinking about doing a podcast, but I think we'll just do a vlog. What is a vlog? Well, just uh, just follow me on. I'm just have cameras everywhere and just. Are you just gonna life. be talking? Yes, yeah, be following my life. Just, just doing shit. Like mm -hmm. what, my, my, my everyday and just kind of. You ain't gonna show the real shit. I'm gonna, gonna show the real shit. You gonna show all the presentable shit. I be going through some crazy shit, shit man. That's me. I be having some. It be some fun ass moments in my life, man. Show when especially, you shave your head. Especially them bitches I be dealing with, huh? <laughs> I said show when you shave your head. <laughs> <laughs> See stuff like that. No, them bitches. What about the bitches? Yeah, nigga, I be going through some shit with them bitches, man. Because them bitches want you to... Look, let me tell you something. One of the most fucked up holidays in the world is coming. <sighs> Yay, Valentine's. Valentine. It is the worst holiday <laughs> for a player. <laughs> oh, yeah. These Why? bitches be thinking that you did them wrong because you won't adhere to what they want you to do on that day. Right. You have lost your fucking mind asking me about Valentine's Day. Do you know bitches didn't put their bed in months before the day? <laughs> <laughs> and you coming with this shit now? Bitch, you, <laughs> you doing something for somebody? I'm always doing something for somebody, but I'm saying Valentine's Day, I am not to be captured and, and, and motherfucking... If, if, if you don't do this, it's over. All that shit, you're wasting your time with me. It is very me. overrated, and they just want money. I'm going to get a bitch a box of chocolates, though. I'll buy a bitch a big-ass bear. All right, I'm going to get a motherfucker a box of chocolates. You got one special one or several? 
No, I, I'm just gonna do it like one. You put oh, him on the black. You put him on the black. You know, know he's a young I man. He ain't ready to talk no, about just, all the hoes. I just don't. But that just means something wanna... sweet doesn't mean it. You could just. Yeah, wait, I'm let him finish. What? I, yeah. I don't do my. The motherfucker be getting on my nerve, man. But this one motherfucker, <laughs> she be cool, man. You See, know, there you go. She it's just, a sweetheart day. Yeah. Right? See, I, I ain't yeah. fucking up. This how. This how. Uh, uh, I lost the friendship with Grady. <laughs> Talk see? about hoes. Yep. Oh, I don't want to put y'all niggas on blast about no hoes. I, mean, I don't give a fuck, man. If I, I'm going to lose a bit, I'm going to lose I believe you don't give a fuck. You, yeah. you ain't no motherfucker. Yeah, I like chocolate enough, man. I don't know. I don't even want anything. Yeah. I just want their presence, not present. Yeah. But I like presence. you give a woman a chocolate. Uh, them being there. It don't, don't matter what they do. It ain't going to be enough. You a girl, D. No, No matter it's not. what a man do, it's never enough. Sorry, it depends on the woman. Oh, my God. I've never cared for any of that stuff. I don't you want to no 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 like with, with the rose petals and shit lean to the to the room and all that shit. Yeah. I'd rather just be I want to Craig made That's a good it. point. But what is you saying about the rose petals? I said, you ain't never thought about romancing a, a, a woman like that, just putting rose petals and shit leading to the room and all that. You're not phone? sweeping up mm -hmm. all that joy <laughs> shit. <laughs> you do it in the alley. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, now Craig a says did this, A bitch did that for me, man. I had a threesome waiting on me. Is that One Valentine's Day. Hell yeah. Can't put that motherfucker. I said, what the fuck is all this shit here? Oh, I'm gonna tell you why I know you're lying. Another bitch in there with her. I said, God damn it, what This is how I know you're lying. Because uh -oh. uh -huh. you're perspiring. Yeah. Your sweatshirt yeah, wet under the arm. And he looked, and, and he looked up and to the left. And he looked up and to the left. Right. <laughs> <laughs> he, looked, he looked up and to the left. <laughs> Fuck your double uh, picture uh, looking yeah. at him. Hey, hey, that shit was funny to the motherfucking face. Huh? No, German Shepherd. That nigga said I look like a German Shepherd. I laughed for 30 minutes. I told my dad. I told my homie. Everybody was crying. Face on, huh? folks. Chocolates ain't enough in L.A., man. If you give Explain a, that. If you give an L.A. woman chocolates, you're going to take them chocolates and go share them with the nigga that you <laughs> Don't Don't lump L.A. women uh, on that. Right. I'm just saying. If LA you can't women, lump L.A. women with anything, what are you lumping well, with? Well, first of all, when you say L.A. women, majority of the women that you're probably talking about are here in L.A., but they're not from L.A. Right, they right, came right. here for a dream. Right. Most people aren't even from L.A. They're not natives. What right. is D talking about? They're not. Let me tell they you something. I can say this about L.A. bitches. or a model or something. L.A. bitches will wear a big ass coat with high heel sandals. And it is the most ridiculous looking <laughs> shit in the world. <laughs> Bitch, buy some nice boots. Yeah. Yeah. Now, if you're Arkansas, you well, could buy... Well, because there's no snow and it's not that <laughs> cold. <laughs> like, it's cold. <laughs> if you're Sorry, Arkansas, Greg. you could buy a bit some high heel jelly. She gonna give you the pussy. <laughs> <laughs> and Alan Iris and if you got a bitch a thrift store yeah. love seat. <laughs> you got nice toenails. Why not show them your round? Bitch, There's I no bought you a love seat. It was fatted yeah. out. You buy that bitch all this shit around the register at the gas station in Arkansas. <laughs> <laughs> you know, <laughs> Is this a Corvette keychain? Or are you gonna get you, <laughs> you gonna pick a bitch up with a taxi for Valentine's Day? <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it ain't all LA women though. I'm, yeah. You know, she you is see, right. Don't let her fix your no, shit for you. No, but it is the truth. You could say a good majority because yeah. I would agree on that. Yeah, a good majority. One time I was at a stoplight on Ventura. This is 2001. I'm mm. from Southern California, but I never really experienced Hollywood. And I and my cousin is a female. She had that XT, that Cadillac XT when it first came out. Mm. Fast than a month. Yeah, I pulled up on the side of this chick. I got her number, and before I pulled off, I was driving. My cousin was in the passenger seat. The chick stopped me. Like, hold on. She said, you look kind of young. Um, whose truck are you driving? Oh, no. When she found out. And I tried to be I honest, know. not knowing the game. I'm like, this bitch bad. I want to be honest. I don't want to start off on the wrong foot lying. So I was like, this is my cousin truck. This her truck. And the bitch told me, well, why don't you go ahead and give my number to your cousin? Oh! Ah! <laughs> That's L.A. Damn! That's L.A. That's the game, nigga. That was that moment, you man. Well, I realized what it was about. But I had, as a grown man, I have to respect her. That's yeah. what she's looking for. That's, that's her like, thing, yeah. yeah. I can't hate Nobody's saying it's cool or right, but yeah, that's her get down. She was honest. Man, when I was a broke nigga, I was fucking bitch. When I was broke, chip tooth, bum ass nigga, I not only was fucking bitches, bitches used to take care of me. It's just when you young and stupid, and you know, God take care of fools and babies. Mm -hmm. Nigga, that's I true. used to go to bitches' house when I was a young nigga. Like, bitches I don't even know. Yeah. Well, you get killed going up in a bitch house. You That's know what I'm saying? Yeah, but I'm saying, like, 
Nigga, the game ain't never stopped for me. Now that I, I, I wish I was rich, but I got enough money to give the average underachieving bitch everything she can imagine. Mm. That's not like some shit this bitch told Buka Pong. <laughs> what the what day, nigga? Buka what the bitch say about? What's up, Buka Pong? What up? Buka. Why? L.A. motherfucker right there. What he say? Buka Pong tried to holler at this bitch. She was like, she said, nigga, I ain't even gay, but I'll fuck your daughter before I fuck you, nigga. Oh, <laughs> you know my saying? lord. Damn. <laughs> Ooh, she did... just told Buka that. Instead of just saying no, she's not even gay. I ain't even wow. gay, but I'll fuck your daughter before I fuck you, nigga. Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, I was uh, hollering, nigga. That's <laughs> you my know, Boo got them big ass eyes. <laughs> <laughs> they damn near popped out. Boo, who got them eyes at the end of that movie? What's that movie? Uh, the Mask. No, what's that movie where they was out of air with Arnold Schwarzenegger? Oh, they were, oh, they were about to blow up at the right. end. He's <laughs> <laughs> stupid. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what, what was that little, uh, the little, the honeycomb thing? Those on them cereal with them big ass eyes. The honeycomb high down. The sugar honeycomb bee. bee. No, it's a honey badger or some shit like that. You know nah, the cereal. Uh, I thought he was talking about sugar. They had different cur commercials in Arkansas. We don't know nothing about that bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> they played honeycomb. They played honeycomb. Them. Honeycomb. Yeah, yeah, the honeycomb. Where? What happened to oats? The oats with the uh, shit in the they middle. They still got the oats. Where? I ain't seen that shit. Little no, honey oats with the little. Stuff what about dig them? Dig them. <laughs> yeah, I did that old CIA. It's a frog, nigga. Who used to have a hat like Cool oh, Rudy yes, on Fat true. Albert. Yeah. Is, is he smacking? Give me a smack. I'll smack, smack you back. back. He was like yeah. the Ike Turner of cereal. Uh, uh, is he smack. smacking It's now? a frog, isn't it? It was a frog. Yeah, but he they still to, got he, him? Niggas give him five and he give you five them big back. ass frog hands. I thought he was. Dig him! Yep. <laughs> is he smacks now? I don't no, know smacks. what they oh, call them. Oh, Diggum Smacks. You talking about Diggum Smacks. The cereal. Uh, no, it's a cereal. No, it's uh -huh. called Smacks. You got a frog. It was a black bear named oh. Super, Super Sugar Chris. He was a black bear. Oh, he, he had a cool player. voice. Yep. Yep. He was like, buy this Super Sugar Chris. You fucked him whole. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Cookie Chris was cool. Cookie Chris. That yeah, that's a lot of sugar. Yeah, they got all that sugar. It was a hillbilly hey. named Waffalo Bill. He was I remember like, that. <laughs> I that commercial you did, uh, Corey. Which one? Only you can prevent forest fires. <laughs> you said I'm Smokey the Bear. <laughs> Don't poke the bear. Hey, if you got a girlfriend. Nah, I fuck you though, man. Hey, oh, man. look at that. You know what? Hey, be getting nah, played. They done rubbed up on you, Abe. Nah, it's really millennial women. There was like too high expectations, and they wanted uh, them to have like a fucking house, car, apartment. Uh, oh, that's too bad. That's Abe is, too a, bad. Abe is, a, is a nice guy, and... Every time I see nice guys with girls, I just pray for them. Mm -hmm. Abe had a girl <laughs> here about two weeks ago, and she was brought up here as a oh, singer. Is she still going to sing? I hit her up. Yeah, yeah. Did you get that pussy yet? Oh, my God. Corey, she can't she can't say, say, Abe ain't got the pussy it. yet. No, I watch niggas when they be with girls. They be like, this is... Phil <laughs> turned out loud. You ain't oh, yeah. shit. You like talking? <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You want to say it on camera? No. What happened? <laughs> she was going to bring her, her man. I was like, nah, don't bring him. Her man? Oh, her man. oh, oh what? Man. Like, she's like, all right, I'll, I'll drop him off. What? Oh, that ain't no man if a bitch dropping you off. A brought a bitch who had a man. And he didn't know how to say, bitch, don't bring no motherfucker around me. Do what you're going to do with that motherfucker and call me when you through. I'm telling you, hey, when you say shit like that, they actually respect you. I know it's hard to believe that, but this is what the world is. If you talk to women like a nice guy, they play you like you a sucker. Hey. Just fuck your man and call me after that, bitch. I don't give a fuck. I take sloppy seconds, bitch. Oh. Well, Abe, you are. <laughs> That's what you got to say, bitch. Abe oh, okay. hey, black women, you know that. You date black women? So what? I'm gonna give you advice. What's wrong about with Abe dating a black girl? Just like I, I date a bitch of any race in my age. I'm just hey, looking for a pussy hole that's easy. Oh, yeah. see, yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. I thought she was a black girl. I seen that. No, no, no. no I'm talking about him. What happened? What'd you black women only respect the headlock. You got to work on your headlock. Oh man. my God! You hear that? You got to get it to where. Don't you, call a bitch yeah. bitch when you're mad at her. Call her a bitch in intimate moment. Yeah. You the best bitch I ever had. They just replayed that. Who put that up for you? That was one of the best. At that shack thingy. Uh, yeah. That was one of. The, that was a good if one. You can I like just her. call the bitch when you get mad. Call right. the bitch when you, when you just kick. Right. Oh yeah. Uh, no, I'm saying like. 
Somebody say Abe a simp. <laughs> Abe is a nice guy and he needs to find a nice woman that respects morality. And there's just not a lot of those bitches around. You got to perfect the vampire choke. If you can choke her and look her in the eyes while you do it, she's going to love you. You got to dog your bitch you out while y'all together. <laughs> that phone. way, when y'all break up, you can say, bitch, you just mad because I ain't do what you wanted me to do. <laughs> <laughs> If you want to impress her when you take her on a date, you got to drive with your mouth on the steering wheel. If you can make a U-turn with your mouth on the you steering wheel. I, be, I believe Craig. I mean, you your know, neck is, your you neck is I amazing. Just, oh, I, I believe you exaggerate, Lester. I don't think Craig's this bad of a guy. Uh, For some Craig, reason, I don't no, Craig ain't a bad guy. Craig is the type of motherfucker. He will be very good to a woman that and mean. only cheat occasionally. Yeah, I ain't cheating all the time. Occasionally? Yeah, I ain't cheating all the time. You don't, you don't want <laughs> I said, I'm not he, he, he talked loud until ah, he gets yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> He said, I, 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 What? What you say, Craig? I said, I don't, say, I said, I don't cheat a lot, nigga. I cheat sometimes. Oh, my yeah. God. Oh. If you're not married, you're single. Hey. That's the law. That's in, in everybody's eyes. Craig, you know? that ain't how these Craig. bitches feel. You know. Yeah, a bitch will it. tell you, what the fuck was you doing with your wife? <laughs> <laughs> this is what a bitch will tell you in America. Hey, <laughs> you lying, nigga? These hoes ain't. This is a part of the show that we hate to stop the momentum for. Oh. Um, it is a part of the show that's been around so long. We was like, fuck it, we'll still do it. Um, Why? Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you these loose talk about bullshit. All right, now, thank you guys for that. <laughs> guys sounded like boys to men on that, bringing me in. Thank you. Um, I know this story has since passed, but I just wanted to bring it up since we didn't really do loose talk the last couple weeks, and then I wasn't here last week. You ain't working on this one. Hmm? Huh? What'd you say? Huh? Oh, my bad. Did you just put your finger in my candy thingy? I'm sorry. Here. What kind of candy you got? Chewy sweet tarts are the best. Oh yeah, my god. Yeah, but you gotta pour man. some out. Oh. Yeah, pour it. I ain't gonna do that. Like mm -hmm. a nigga ain't never put his hand in your mouth. Excuse me. <laughs> not during <laughs> COVID. Not really. Anyway. Yeah, not during COVID. So I know this story since passed, but I still wanted to hear what you guys think of the recent claims. And I know you know what I'm talking about that Wendy Williams has been making. Oh, um, as well as, do you think that, um, that it's simply to gain more buzz because Lifetime, you know, just released her documentary as well as a movie based around her, the drama with her divorce. Now, if you're not aware of the latest, she's been making the publicity rounds to promote the two new releases. And in an interview on January 28th, she spoke about her alleged one night affair with Method Man, where she claims that she smoked a blunt with him while she gave him a bath. She followed this by saying that he'll probably deny it, maybe not. She said it wasn't in the movie because he's still angry at her for being her, for telling the truth. Uh, then the interviewer asked if they'd, if, did they go all the way? And she said yes. Um, she didn't say when that supposedly occurred, but she did give suggestions that it was during the height of the Wu-Tang's run. Um, I mean, I don't know. I mean, come on. Whether it be a man or a woman, I don't know. When It's very messy and pretty lame when you talk like that about, you know, stuff that's supposed to have been, if it happened. I don't, I don't know. But anyway, Method Man's wife, Tamika, has now gotten involved by posting a comment about Wendy's... Uh, revelation um of course she's uh she's been married to method man for 20 years so basically you're saying oh okay so that happened while he was with me huh so she's um so they've been going kind of back and forth back and forth but i i didn't dig it at all so so i, I seen the old picture of wendy wendy what bag back in the gap yeah she was at a point no night. nobody's not knocking i'm just saying but why speak on it y'all could speak about you know, saying, your sex talking, capades she's talking but about shit when she was she actually look worse, so bitch, don't yeah, embarrass Yeah, but if you, you were like married that, right? and all that, you really think, I don't think it was very cool of her to do that at all. But anyway, go ahead. Wendy Williams married a fat. True or not? Who didn't want her, but he hustled her. Mm. She is so hurt, she's steady talking shit to bring drama to other people's lives. Ah, there you go, good she one. She looked Bruce. miserable. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't piss on the bitch. <laughs> And I done fuck bitches way uglier than her. But her, 
That insecurity is the most ugliest shit in the world to me. Mm. A bitch who you could tell hate herself, I wouldn't piss on Wendy Williams. Okay. I might still fuck, man. What? <laughs> God damn, Craig. Try to get on, nigga. I'm That's a problem. Yeah. Bitches out here fucking to get yeah, on. Why they, can't I fuck a bitch to get on? I ain't try to get yeah, on like that. So, so you know, shit. What if she gave you a week's notice? What would you do to better yourself? <laughs> <laughs> you got a week to fuck the bitch. Would you <laughs> sleep with Noxima on it? Oh, <laughs> mm, 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 mm. <laughs> no, man. I, what you do to prepare to hit Hope Flood every Sunday? What you do? <laughs> <laughs> I, I put shit, the blinders in my eye. <laughs> so, so Craig, you fuck Lunel to get on? No. <laughs> oh, see, so he's, he's got a level. He's got some now. standards. No, Lunel, old. I don't want to destroy your pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you think? I think she's the same. I don't fuck even. Fuck it, uh, I Leslie I think Jones. Wendy and her are around the same age. Really? Yeah. Yo, I was just pussy crack. <laughs> <laughs> I was just fucking Leslie Jones, nigga. Le I fuck Leslie. Oh, this nigga. Yeah, man. What's so, the worst bitch you could think of? It, the, that she ain't, she ain't, she ain't, she ain't that from, famous, though. He come from Arkansas. Mm -hmm. You done seen ugly bitch. She ain't famous. She just, she, she end up uh, getting some fame oh. uh, from a video. <coughs> Uh, it's, it's her name, she actually from Arkansas. She was, she was a motherfucker like, uh, she had this little phrase. But her name Tashika, but her, she had this what? little taka. They call her taka. And she had this little phrase. I forgot what the little phrase was. Would she, you fuck Precious? No. In the movie. No. What's wrong no, no. with Gabby? What's no, no. wrong with her? No, no. What's wrong with Precious? Yeah. Every. <laughs> What's the, I, don't know the, I don't know her name as an actress. Mm -hmm. Oh, Gabrielle Sidibe. Precious is not my type. But. Gabriel Iglesias? <laughs> <laughs> nah, you ain't saying anybody love you, boy. Anyway, all right, let's keep it going. Lunel, Lunel ain't ugly, though, so I just, I don't, 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 uh, right. I'll sit on that little German Shepherd nose of yours. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, D, with the rest of your bullshit. All right, so of course everybody's still talking about the little Uzi Bert, um, oh his damn God. 24 million supposedly pink diamond that he had implanted into his forehead. Um, so according to the rapper, um, he's, he's saying that he spent the past several years paying off this expensive diamond, one of a kind diamond, in order to complete the feat of his body modifications. Um, yeah, so now the fight, and, and you know, he was promoting it, put it on his Instagram. Do we have that picture of it? And um, so now that the jewelers finally have come forward, because everybody was like, what is this? It's real. The stone comes courtesy of the New York based jewelers, Elliot. Elliot and company who specializes in custom pieces worn by a lot of celebrities. Um, I don't know, 24 million. They said that he started to pay them back in 2017 when he saw the stone and he fell in love with it. He said that he's been thinking um, of doing it. And That's he, a weird ass And he though. did it, so. He's, he's just a weird individual altogether, man. But this yeah. nigga got, you seen the book? It is uh, not, This nigga man. got a diamond. Right here, in the center of his eyebrows, a pink diamond, twenty-four oh. million dollar diamond, in the center of his forehead, right here. You know what that means, right? What? See, when niggas rob you, I don't want that shit to fuck up the you show. Fuck her. No, I don't know who that bitch is. When niggas rob that nigga after they heat that out, they normally take what's in your pockets. Jesus mm -hmm. Christ. Them niggas going in his head. head. Off, they're going to cut yeah, the head off. they're going to do like Thanos. We had that right. vision. He grabbed it and said, Ugh. Thanos. Yeah. Thanos like a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> you never heard it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but there's a nigga did it before. Sauce Walker, he got a, a teardrop. 
Diamond? It's got a diamond in there? Yeah, it's got a diamond teardrop right there. So they've been going back and forth about it. But man, mm. ain't no way. They did this shit off of, of a cartoon shit. That was a cartoon shit they did. Mm, mm, mm. Bro, that's not her put. That's her back. It's a tough. But that, that's the that, that motherfucker. That's the craziest shit in the world to me, man. Yeah, that's wild. It's like, save your money. What are you doing? Blow your goddamn head off $24 million. You understand know me? Shoot your whole goddamn security crew. Say, the coroner taking that shit. She, that is just when you go. Oh, yeah, when you go. Shit. It's not. That shit coming up missing. It's not even attractive. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, you got to be look at it. Look at it. Oh, oh, at it. oh. Yeah, I can't. He kind of like Kane on Mr. Side. No. Mm. He's got nice teeth. Yeah, if you got a diamond like that's that, you better, better have boy. nice teeth. That's what I was going to say. Yeah, that would have been ridiculous if had he had mess, messed up teeth. My goodness. That's man. a wild boy. Yeah, that nigga that crazy. That is crazy. They said Thanos. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Crazy. Ooh, there you, you go. Better, good one. Good well, one. Well, I better, up, that's good. I better, I better be able to push that motherfucker in and do something. Ooh, as soon as he get in an argument with him, who you talking to? Look, look, get your goof ass out here with a diamond that, in your mouth. Pull that diamond out. Pull it up. It don't even look like shit. It's it, yeah, crazy, it's just right? It's stupid. That pinky it's ring dope he got, though. That pinky <laughs> ring is the shit. Nigga, ask him to be killed. This nigga got a piece of Craig shirt in his head. <laughs> 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 On a, on a lighter note, or somber mo note, um, just wanted to say, uh, rest in peace, uh, Mary Wilson. She passed yesterday, Monday, February 8th, at the age of 76. For those that don't, aren't aware of who she was, she was the co-founder, along with Florence Ballard, of the Supremes. Rest original in peace. members, yeah. The group was originally called the Primettes. Then Diana Ross later joined, so those that don't know. Mary's, Mary's cause of death is still a bit of a mystery, though. Her publicist only said that she died suddenly. Some reports are claiming that she actually passed in her sleep, but just two days prior to that, um, to her death, she posted a video on her YouTube channel announcing that she was working on a record company, working with a rec record company on an album. So it looked and sounded like she was pretty healthy. Damn, rest in um, peace. Yeah, so there you go. Hey, this is a cold motherfucking world, man. We be here for a minute, we be gone. That's why I don't trip off the little shit. Like that, yeah. And again, we spoke Real about stuff. Cicely Tyson. Again, rest in peace to Cicely Tyson, phenomenal woman. Yeah. I'm in, halfway through her memoir. It's just incredible. It's called Just As I Am. Um, I'm at the chapter where she's talking about her and Miles Davis's relationship, and it is just, oof, I get goosebumps. I mean... What makes you have goosebumps? Um, it's just so sweet, like in heavy duty. Like, I didn't realize it was that deep. You know, like the, how they had a relationship early on. She wasn't going for it, whatever, left, got famous, did her whole career, whatever. And then they had another run in. He never gave up on her, whatever. He came back, kept begging on her, you know, asking her, like, would you marry me, whatever. She didn't want that part of life, but she stayed his friend. She actually, and even his family can attest to this, that she basically saved his life. Because by the time she came back in on that second leg, because she was concerned about him, nobody had heard from him, she was the one who actually went and found him, nursed him back to health. Oh. <laughs> anyway, they after that is when they finally got married. It was really touching. Like it just gives me like it's so sweet. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute, Cole, you said I said Thanos rooms. So how you say it, Thanos? Thanos. <laughs> huh? You spelled it T H E Y N O S E. <laughs> you said they knows. <laughs> 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 Who is Leon? Somebody say R.I.P. Brother with Leon. That's Leon. Somebody who passed. We don't, we the don't. actor? Nah. Who are they talking about? That would be really sad. They, they, they talking about say, Leon from Five Hundred. I say Corey built like the leader of the gang of the Wild Possum group. What? I don't know nothing about that. And like we were saying earlier, Valentine's is this Sunday, February fourteenth, and depending on what kind of person or person you're around. You might not care at all for it, but might be a good time if you're going to get a gift for somebody. You might want to get it now. Again, I, I don't care about that. So if you're listening or watching, I'm gonna just be around. Anyway, so uh, at the week at the restaurant this weekend, anybody comes in and orders um, a meal, uh, they're making these special chocolate-covered dipped Oreo cookies, and you'll get one on the house. So. Oh, okay. Mm. I'm, come, I'm come get some to eat. There you go. Hey, let me ask you this: What's what's a good Valentine's gift? Oh, what see, kind of girl? I'm not, yeah, see, that's a, see, 
always depends on the girl. I always yeah. think you know the practical kind of girl things. You got. Yeah, you already, that's what I just said. You'll know what kind of woman you have. So I don't know. Is she into certain things? Because, see, I'm a practical person. She's into his car until he threw it in. She get out. Yeah, uh, she's into his car and out of his car. <laughs> get out of my dream. Get in like into my car. Get into my car. <laughs> <laughs> How long you known her? Y'all fucking? You really like her? Yeah, yeah. Nigga, I think I'm a consider this. You're think, he's thinking of getting or something? That's, yeah, that's pretty incredible. No, it's getting deep. What kind of work she do? Just don't be, you know? Don't put him on the spot oh, to say that. Yeah. Ask him a question he could be proud of. She do some nursing shit. <laughs> you ain't sick. See, see, everybody think I ain't sick. Craig, Craig is a menace. <laughs> you are the worst. The nigga said he do some nursing shit, not that she a nurse, nigga. That's funny as a motherfucker, nigga. It's a nurse and assistant. That could just be a bitch that owns The nurse would be like, wipe his ass for me. <laughs> that could just be a bitch that owns a first aid kit, <laughs> She got band-aids at the house. She just right. <laughs> <laughs> That's messed up. She work a lot of hours. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she work a lot of hours. Well, she work her own now. Oh, okay. she do what? She, she do in home hug, in home own, care, in home care. Mm -hmm. That means she was smart. She, she's still in school. What kind of car Leon Spinks? Is that who they're talking about? Yeah, oh, Leon, Leon Spinks. Hey, one of what's name's coldest bitches about Leon Spinks, man. Uh, Richard Pryor. He talk about how Leon Spinks got caught. Buying a dollar fifty worth of cocaine. A dollar fifty. <laughs> you never heard that bit, nigga. Oh, oh that's me, coke. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Rest in peace, Leon Spinks. He was cold. respect, that's brother it. Leon. Yeah. Oh Aww. man, we losing so many motherfuckers, man. Yeah. I hope I ain't in that mix. I want to be around for at least another fifty, nigga. Me too. Another fifty years. Another like fifty Hope? at least. You wanna do one on one? You wanna be a hundred? I don't know if I wanna do a one on one, man. What? Hundred? I don't What's know wrong if I wanna do a how old was Bob Hope when he passed? There's gonna be too much, so much shit going on. Bob Hope. I'm gonna be talking shit though, but I just wanna be in good condition though. If I'm gonna be, if I'm gonna be that old, I wanna be in good condition. I remember. Why you wanna be in condition? You just wanna be old. Yeah, but I want to be in good condition. I wanna still be fucking. Yeah, you don't wanna be immobile. If I'm gonna be, if I'm be, what's the point of me being here if I can't fuck? A bitch can sit on you're your head. You're not gonna want to at that point. When you're older no. like that, you're probably not gonna want to. No, you know, you're gonna in the gym, getting right. You can't fuck fathom that. Shit. that I just want to be able to talk and be coherent. That's right. I'll be in a wheelchair. Look at that motherfucker right there. Yeah. Get your big face ass out of here. Fucking is a big task. Yeah. See, when you're older, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah they're gonna be talking about your head, cool. That shit, I don't you know. Hell, <laughs> look, hey, hell ain't ready for you yet, is it, right. Corbin? Yeah, that's right. I ain't gonna put him in my, in my movie. <laughs> I believe in reincarnation. I, I think when we go out, we right back to this motherfucker person. No, Come back that's, as that's, another if had, that's if you've. We're a bad person, I believe you'll come back. You think it's such thing? So if you're a bad person, you come yeah. back? So if you're a good person, where you go? Well, just be glad you're coming back. Why would you want to come back? I'm saying you coming back. I'm not coming back. Reincarnation make more crazy. sense. Reincarnation make more, make more not, sense no. to me. Oh, I don't want to be What no. makes a person a bad person? Huh? Is there anybody, can anybody answer that? I don't think it's such thing as a bad person. Uh, <laughs> it's oh, by perspective. Exactly, but that's because what I'm saying. What's bad if you so survive, hard. but if you survive circumstances, Whatever you got to do to survive that, how can you be a bad person if you surviving? You a bad person if you scared to tell people where you gonna be because motherfuckers is at you. Right. But, I'm saying you. I mean, it's, it's it's motherfuckers out here. They can't even. They can't say nothing. Right. Cause if they say, "Hey, I'm gonna be here," motherfucker gonna roll up on them. Yeah. That's a bad person. Yeah. I mean, it's good. It was well, about, my mom like said, was a respect. very bad person. Your mom was a bad person. <laughs> Horrible person. But was that by certain? Was that based on what happened to her, or did she just treat yeah, she how she treated everybody? Yeah. You know, like like, like, like yeah. I said, good news about is about perspective. Mean. Like just like in, during slavery times, like those uh, owners, the uh, slave masters. Most of them motherfuckers felt like they was good people, and that was the majority of, of the world. They felt like it. Sure. sure. They had a book called. They, Go ahead. Yeah, but but I mean, there was evil motherfuckers though. Evil. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Mm -hmm. So who is they? It's like who the slave masters? There was some evil mother. Would they feel like they were good people? And so it's like it's it's about perspective. Like, have you ever met? Now this is really putting you on the spot. Have you ever met a Caucasian person that was just, that was really fair? Have you yeah. ever met one? I have. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. 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 I'm just asking. Like, I'm, <clears throat> who who did you meet? My great grandmother. White like a motherfucker. Mm -hmm. Family Irish, member. Irish and Potawamo Indian. She. Now when she, when the Alzheimer's kicked in, she forgot she had black grandkids. Uh -oh. So she used to call the police on niggas. Every oh. She used to come out the bag on y'all. And, you know, and she was when she, when she forgot herself, she was a motherfucker. But when she was her, oh, she was she was cool. Okay, so, mm -hmm. does, so does, does that mean she really is a bad person then? No, no because that's not really because you. When you because have dementia, because that's not because that's not like those, she forget to be nice. Like, when she forget to be because that's not like she was no, it's no being her mind. real her true self. No, it's no longer would. your mind when you have dementia. Yeah, it's dementia not even her. Yeah, it's like dementia, it's no longer yeah, your mind. Dementia is different. Has nothing to do with yeah, memory and yeah. things like that. I think dementia is when people say what the fuck they want to say and people come up with a name no, called dementia. Some of us can't even remember how to get back home. They can know how to go to the bathroom, all that. Well, they go back to their, their root memory, though. No, that's like, ridiculous. Because she married my grandfather. Marcus fuck crazy. dropping them, them, them dimes over there. That ain't no motherfucking dime. <laughs> I like my grandfather married my, grandmother, uh, my grandfather in the late 20s. But your grandfather was black? Yeah. He putting that wood on him. Yeah, oh, he met her Lord. on the motherfucking train, nigga, and, and risked his life, risked their lives to be together. They moved to Cal they moved to Pasadena in the 30s because that was one of the first places that openly accepted interracial dating. Do you believe that people can put a face on for years? Of course. It's called a persona mask. Fuck you up with that. You ain't think he knew that, did he? <laughs> but what you gotta understand about a woman is really whatever who's ever fucking that woman, that's where she is. You ever heard now of that's deep. Whoever what? Whoever's fucking that woman, that's what she is. Wait, wait, Craig. Wait, 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 Craig, wait, wait, wait. please say it one more time. So whoever's fucking that woman, that's what she is. So all so, you so, bitches who talking shit about me after we break up. What do you mean by that's what she my is? Grand, some niggas said fuck my coon and grandpa. My grandfather would dog walk your bitch ass, nigga. <laughs> Bill would wake up out the grave and don't Bill. be calling that nigga a coon. Nigga, I wish you would come around the Smith household calling Bill a coon. Nigga, you'll get your ass. I'm tired of niggas thinking because they black and ugly as fuck that that mean they blacker than the next nigga. Blackness ain't got nothing to do with your skin color, nigga. If you don't have a black conscious, nigga, you ain't black. Mm. If you wearing Gucci and Prada and worried about Jordans and bullshit, nigga, you ain't black, nigga. You white, you fucking European nigga, mm. you bitch ass motherfucker. I'm tired of these niggas thinking they black because they skin color, nigga. In history, Black is a way of life, nigga. What are you doing? When the last time you spoke up for a black person? Mm. When the last time you risked your motherfucking life in the protection of another African American doing person? doing my face when me and yeah. Zoe was arguing. Yeah, in history, yeah. in history, a lot of the, uh, <laughs> you the niggas, most militant <laughs> folks was light skin. Niggas run around here with dreads <laughs> and army pants and big ass boots thinking that they more black than the next nigga. Man, fuck you, nigga. And run up if you got a problem. I'm tired of niggas. You got blackness fucked up, bro. Mm. Half, mm. Of you, half of you dark, ugly motherfuckers was telling on niggas I was escaping <laughs> from the plantation, you bitch-ass oh, niggas. Jesus. I'm tired of these hoe-ass niggas, man. Real spit, man. <laughs> nah, niggas got the game fucked up, bro. I seen the movie One Night Miami. Miami. Oh. Hey, that was black. Uh, yeah, yeah, I seen it. It was whack. Ain't no way Sam Cooke was gonna talk to Malcolm X like that. That was some bull. Malcolm X would have beat the dog shit out of uh, Sam Cooke. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just uh, <laughs> that shit crazy. <laughs> <laughs> and who was harder out of Malcolm and, and Malcolm? Malcolm didn't want, I mean, Martin didn't want to fight nobody. Malcolm was trying to put hands on niggas. Now, Malcolm, let's just suck the <laughs> oh. dick so they let us get in the car. <laughs> oh, <my> Jesus. <laughs> nigga. Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> just let them rub your ass, rub your ass. <laughs> All I'm saying, go to Africa, nigga. It's nigga. <laughs> Ethiopia. It, everybody ain't run around Ethiopia black as a motherfucker. They brown skin and light skin in Ethiopia. Eritrea, nigga. You know what I'm saying? You motherfuckers got the game fucked up, man. Colorism is a motherfucker, man. Mm -hmm. Straight out, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> now, I love my people, man, but y'all got up on the Craig's kid. There you go. Straight out, Yeah, man. he done let that white side unleash. That's the way to go. <laughs> you niggas, I'm talking... <laughs> <laughs> Everyone will die. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Nigga, find those niggas. 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 Nigga, find Niggas. Niggas.
bitch ass niggas.
bitch ass niggas. niggas 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 niggas
ass niggas. niggas Everybody, uh, for those that have the situation this weekend, happy Valentine's. But if you don't like to hear them, here we go. Welcome to the introducing the non Valentine. That's right. I want to dedicate this song to all the people who can remember what they practiced. I yeah. Well, we just putting this out Valentine's Day records. Hit it. You was my bitch. Oh. You was my bitch. Whoa. You was my bitch. Whoa. You was my bitch. Whoa. You was my bitch. Oh. You was my bitch. Oh. You was my bitch. Oh. You was my bitch. Check it out. You was my bitch. I'd show you off to the world. I'll tell everybody that you was my girl. Oh. You was my bitch. Oh. I'd fuck you real slow. So the kids can't hear when you close your bedroom door. Oh. Hey. You was my bitch. Oh. You was my bitch. Oh, use my bitch. Oh, use my bitch. Oh, 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 oh. Use my bitch. Oh, use my bitch. Oh, if use my bitch. Oh, use my bitch. Tell them where well, you belong to me. Oh. You are never free. Oh. I'm a crazy ass nigga. Oh. And my love comes with the fee. 
hey, hey. You got to pay that cost huh? Don't act like you lost hey, Baby hey. girl, I'm the boss hey, And you hey. know what's going on You was my bitch 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 Use my bitch. Oh. Use my bitch. Oh. Use my bitch. Oh. Use my bitch. When you use my bitch. Oh. On them corners hitting licks. Oh. Girl, you had all the tricks. Oh. And I thought we'd get rich. Today <laughs> your ass quit. Oh. And you had a nigga sick. Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh. You funky ass, funky ass bitch. Use my bitch. Use my bitch. Use my bitch. If you my bitch. Use 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 my bitch. my bitch. I got her out there on the track. The bitch walk, clills go click clack. Clack, clack. She get money for me now. Mm. Bitch, ask me, how can you dog me out? Work me like this. I said it's because I'm the shit. You was my bitch. I'ma stay hit licks. You was my bitch. Back in the day. You was our bitch. I had the gray. You was my bitch. Hey. You was my bitch. Hey. Use my, use my, use my, bitch. Use my, bitch. Use my, 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 use Come back to this. You was my bitch. You was my bitch. I balled you to lick. Even though I took a shit. You was my bitch, and I'm so glad. You was my bitch who lit my eye. Bitch, I'm gone. I thought we was at a home. Now I'm all alone. All my hope is gone. Bitch, you know you're wrong. Give it up for our musical Got me talent. Singing songs. Nail with the edge all gone. All night long. Hey. Bitch, you got me gone. Damn. <laughs> hey. Peace, y'all. Peace, y'all. Bitch! 5150. Oh, fucking bitch! 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 You was my bitch. Oh, God, no, no. 5150, we up at this motherfucker. You did catch y'all motherfuckers oh. next week. You dig what I'm saying? Valentine's Day. Try to work it out with them hoes. Hey. <laughs> All right.
bitch ass niggas. niggas niggas Bitch-ass niggas. niggas
bitch ass niggas. niggas 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 niggas
bitch ass niggas. They can see us? Yup. What happened to the beat, nigga? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Late night is still in the chat room, huh? Talking shit. Check it out. Yeah. <laughs> talking shit, swallow a spit. We talking shit, swallow a spit. And it goes a little something like this. Late night, out here. In LA, I don't give a fuck what a bitch got to say. I'm knocking on your door and I am not calling. So my dick and my balls can be in your twat at your spot. Your old man asleep is hot. Sneak out to the car with your boy. I got a big seat and some plastic toys. We about to blow. His stomach gon' grow. <laughs> We saw it in the chat. Somebody said he looked like Jennifer Hudson. <laughs> yeah, still sitting around, thinking if we gonna go around town and get something to eat or go to bed and bitch watch the feet. What? Stay the talk of shit. I'm working bitches. Yeah. Uh, car hitting switches. Hey, whoop on the ditches. Hey. <laughs> Put my foot in your ass till I got a leg full of pain. Bitch, you broke. You better go beg for some chains. I'm accurate. I don't beg for no aim. Hit a bitch and make her leg turn lame. Yeah, it's the type of nigga I am. This pink shirt on. If your pussy ain't wet, a nigga ain't got to aim. Aim. That ain't what I meant to say. I meant to say, <laughs> if your pussy real wet, a nigga ain't got to aim. Nigga gon' fall in that thing. Pussy. But dry pussy bitches need to quit. Boil your shit. Hey. I stay the talking shit in the comments. You need to quit. My underarm sweating cause I'm working your bitch. Hey. Oh, hold up, boy. Hold up, dog. Something a lot of niggas need to know. Don't fuck a bitch with your dick cause one day it won't grow. Fuck her in the mind. Tell her what she need to know. Tell her when to stop and tell the bitch when she should go. Mm. Yeah, I bet your skull cap stain. I bet your skull cap stain. <laughs> Shit smell like just put it on tonight. Bought it two days ago, so the smell is real light. Took it off and really wasn't even that polite. Till I crossed my legs and hit that bitch with some eggs. Fuck it. Of course, with the two, he just got on all black. And it's matte. My fur. And fat. <laughs> Get <it> back. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We just came back on the mic. We all fucking dykes. Woo. You don't know what type of hoes that woman like. She done licked pussy before. Oh, that's why her nose don't never grow. Hey, we bitch, we in the whack oh. every time. Oh, yeah. Keeping it real. It said I didn't need to chill. This bitch look like they found her in the water next to Emmett Till. Soggy as a motherfucker and all that spill. <laughs> Abortion clinic babies are hey. created by the ladies. Hey. From all back in the 80s, hey. they turned their kids' body to gravy. Every time I get on the show, I'm always looking clean. The show is over. This the uh, deleted scenes. Uh, she she allergic to niggas. She sneezed and I said, Gazoon Dyke. Not I Gazoon know this dyke. here ain't luck. Every time Marcus talk, his eyes straight buck. Yeah. Eating the salami. Bitch, put some weight on you. Running around here looking like Gandhi. Can't believe you like a Rwandi. Refugee. Fuck you, go take a pee. 
Hey. I don't fuck with bitches that don't. I finger fuck the bitch with roach spray on my head. Hey. <laughs> Corey always talking shit, but I don't really care. Hey, watch out. I think some great uh, fill out your hair. Niggas. Yeah, bitch, I got acne and I'm damn near 40 and I look like I drive a taxi, but still get at me. I'm confident. I don't be on no bullshit, but I will pull out the driveway and go to another bitch's house around the way. Start collecting some of that bitch's pay. Hey, I'm just a backwards ass nigga. Walking forward, watch me pull the trigger. We about to go. This was bonus parts of the show. Everybody here. Drop the mic, nigga. So, 5150 bonus sessions in this bitch. We about to get, huh? What's up with a new beat, nigga? Fuck it, come on. Hell no. Bitch, I'm chewing on Nicky Red. You smoking on menthol. Fuck. These boxes been dropped. Oh. The bitch got menthol on her mouth. The bitch got menthol on her mouth. Smell a breath. The, the bitch, bitch got, got menthol on her mouth. I smell that bitch. Brush your teeth. She had some pills when my nut came out. Boo! Hey. hey. Glad to meet you. I know I look like the dad from Moesha. My <laughs> everyday <laughs> nigga. And I ain't playing around when I deliver. Bitch, gotta go to work in the morning. Cause shit to do. Paid too many taxes and my draw smell like mildew. Cause it's water on my brain And I'm just doing my thing And I'm putting my dick in her brain I got polo on cause players only love one And that's the money Finna go fuck this bitch with this uh, pure honey Hey, finna give me some of that gun Leave a real cut Niggas a bitch, he not gonna stick around When I square up, that nigga square down Cause he's a clown You say that's your man? You don't even have a plan I slap that nigga with an open hand and make the man. Fucking your bitch by the grocery store. Hey. That be hard. In the neighborhood she known as a fucking hoe. Where you live at, hoe? Where you stay? Well, I'm fucking your bitch by the grocery store. Hey. Where you live at, hoe? Hey. Where you stay? I used to fuck her when she stayed next door. Ain't this a shame? Mm. She gave me a disease. I came back in three weeks and said, please, please, please give it to me once again. Cause this one bitch ain't my friend. I wanna give her that shit you gave to me. Hey. So bitch, drop down on your knees and give me that motherfucking chlamydia twice. Hey. So I can put it in this other bitch life. Hey. Your bitch getting fucked by the grocery store. Hey. Hey. That bitch pussy was good. I just fought it on the stage right now for sure. Woo. Bitch, you have been had. I'm a dog, watch my tail wag. You have been glad when I left. Cause you've been dead. Listen, since she was a child and I don't never want to see you smile. The bitch, the bitch pussy was good and she gave a disease. E. Ooh, that pussy was fired twice. Woo, can I get some more please? This fart smell like burnt baby bees. Woo! I can think of that. These farts. I'm finna go eat some chicken. Chicken. I'm about this bitch. Thinking it's too late for you to be eating chicken. You got a fart on your heart. I can smell it when you breathe. It's kind of tart when you bark. You a narc from the start. Working with the police, knowing it's an art to be dark. It's um, an art to be dark. <laughs> <laughs> you a dirty motherfucker, Phil. <laughs> I think I'm buff, Joe. Fuck yeah. You look like an art bark. Art bark. Bitch, cut me with some hard bark. Bitch, you tarred nart. Coming to a city near you. The pimple face 40 year old.
Love is like a fart. If you have to force it, it's probably shit.